Greetings, everybody. Let me adjust the music. Oh. Hello. Hello. Oh, Hello. <laughs> huh? I love you. I was like, I'm really just hurt. Ooh. You know? <laughs> I mean, that's abnormal for this group, how? Uh, good points. Good point. Whatever, whatever. <laughs> hey, gamers! Mm -hmm. Holy shit! It's Dungeon Select time. We still play D and D around here. Isn't that fucking crazy? Yes, Sometimes. Yeah. Uh, we're all back from our uh from our you know from the Canada trip and 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 recovered and all that. Uh, Bell will not be joining us today because Bell uh, is not feeling too great, and Ethan will be joining us over the break because he has a stinky itch. That's why she's new not job joining and all us. That. So we'll, Ethan will be here over the break. Bell will hopefully be back next week, but uh, we're gonna get the ball rolling again. We've we've all taken our hiatus. Uh, Canada was fucking fire, and I want to go back, and I miss being in Canada tremendously. Um, but it was good. It was it was a fucking good ass trip, and it was good to you know hang out with the gamers. ARL for uh, for a good little bit. Finally got to meet Laura face to face for the first time. That was pretty cool. Meeting James first face to face was cool. Fair, accurate. <laughs> no, no, dude, <laughs> meeting meeting James' mom was the coolest. <laughs> Big up, Big up, Brenda. Big up, dude. Uh, but yeah, we're uh, ready to get the fucking ball rolling again. You know, you guys got some dragons to fucking kill, baby. Oh, fuck, Andrew. Oh, we already killed them all. What do you mean? Oh, oh did, I, did I forget? Did I misremember? I thought you only yeah. killed one so far. No, 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 we killed them all. Oh. It's just campaign three, session one, Dutch. Oh. Wake up. <laughs> this is where I like, wake up from a coma in a hospital. What no, the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Dude, all of us around you. I've got a fun little anecdote to start the, uh, the stream off with, guys, because I did something really stupid a couple days ago. I'm still so okay. cool. That's a fuss. Only one thing? Rude. So, laptop chargers, right, guys? You know, yeah. they all kind of look the same, right? They're like a circular, little, like a cylinder, little little, little pin, Yarp. right? Mm -hmm. So, I had my laptop charger laying on the floor in my bedroom. And it was dark. Lights on. I came from the shower, butt-ass naked, and I walk into my room, <laughs> and I like... And I step on my laptop charger, and dude... Like a Lego... You'd say, no, it worse. You'd say, like, oh, that's very blunt. That what? went fucking, now it, it went straight into my foot. Like, so now I just got, like, I got stabbed by my own laptop charger. And there's just a hole in my foot now. And it hurts like a bitch, like, standing Did on it, it bleed? and stuff. Oh, yeah. That like a bitch. Did you Jerry bro, you put blood in your laptop charger? That's weird. Ooh. Okay, bro. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so now I got, like, I just got a hole, a hole in my foot. And uh, it, it hurts a lot. It there's a hole in my heart when you're gone. Oh, cute. Um, so that was me a couple days ago. <laughs> Strong. I figured I'd share that with you. Uh, I'm a big idiot. But... It was dark, man. I didn't have the lights turned on. I was like, ah, pff, whatever. And, you know, stabbed myself. Very cool. Um, but yeah, we're here. Anyone, uh, you know, we're back. We play D&D &D around here, guys. Pog, am I right? We're all going to be using yeah. our... our, our... Fucking D twenty that we got from for for being at Lauren James's wedding. So if we all yeah, wait, wait to make me feel left out. Yours is in the Yours mail. You're still getting one. I know. I know. Should have been there. Mine is in my dice back. Oh, oh, I know. It'll come dice, just huh? in time to roll death saving throws from the next dragon. Yeah. Sure. Where's uh? Where is I it? do have I do have an uh announcement yeah, real yeah, quick. We'll, uh, um, roll into announcements. Yeah. Uh, the for the rest of this month. That's uh, still like two more weeks ish i think not yeah like bait just two weeks uh i'm raising money for saint jude play live again and uh have we're only 38 dollars away from me doing another roll for makeup stream just D, &D adjacent because like dice rolling and like fate decide things uh lots of fun incentives and the, there's a donation poll up in the campaign that you can use your donation to vote for who's the best Baldur's Gate 3 companion. And only one person has actually used their donation to Bro, vote in the poll. I'm so right real. now, Shadow I donated, is running away with it. I donated, and that <laughs> poll is not obvious, man. Like, it's it's hidden, you know what I mean? Well, it's there. <laughs> I don't know how to change Tiltify's interface. But no, anyway, you so if you do check nice. out the campaign, the poll is there. Look for it. Because right now, only one $10 donation has been allotted to the poll. So by just $10, Shadowheart is winning. So if you want to dethrone Shadowheart as the best Baldur's Gate She's like the worst one. 
Sandra. I think you mean she's the best. I will not take any shit about Sandra like, around here. Yeah, makes up of, course, of course, Koiba is into the most fucking all I'm saying, plain all I'm and is, boring Baldur's Gate companion, bro. All I'm Holy saying shit. is, if it's still like that easy to dethrone her, like the last day of the campaign, I'm just going to throw in a cheeky donation right before I close the campaign. That's $1 more for Asterian. So unless you guys make it hard oh. for me to do that, Asterion's gonna win, so you better like, start putting some money as down. As far as like, personalities go, That's even terrible. Gale has more personality in his <laughs> pinky finger than Shadow. Oh, You're wrong. You just got your no Shadow Heart. You just got to know. Gale is the most annoying oh. companion there is. Whoa, 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 whoa! Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Don't you have terrible taste? Yeah. What the hell? Shadow Heart boring. Shadow Heart's right? not boring. Mm. She's she has the most bitch. in depth, cool story. Right. Bitch. And I just want her to demean me for the entirety of the playthrough. Okay, okay. okay. If you want to be demeaned, you should go for Lazelle, man. She's best at that. Well, <laughs> no, if you want to be pegged, you go for Lazelle. <laughs> There's levels to this, Laura. Okay, There's, There's levels. levels. Either way, I put the link in the chat for the Tiltify campaign. We're going till the end of May, and there's more incentives after the roll for makeup stream, and there's also just individual donation incentives. It's going to be a fun time. I did my part. I donated to both yours and Briar's you did. And, and Dutch and... Had, and Dutch picked the fun reward where I had to do a spoonful of Carolina Reaper infused yeah. maple syrup yeah. that we bought at Maple yeah. Fest. Great. I was, man, I was so waiting for you midway through to be like, oh, Koiva, your turn. I'm like, no, we'll fucking do it. I know. <laughs> I was going to be that. You, if you, if you, you had done? offered, would I'd be like, oh, fuck, fuck yes, no. let's go. Absolutely the fuck not. <laughs> And I, I got Briar spice. to I'm make good. me a cool little dinosaur scratch art thingy, bro. This thing's cute as fuck. Big pog? No, I did my part you? for the kids. Chat. Now, it's, now, it's, now it's on y'all. Um, and if you're in the US, it's also tax deductible, your donation. Just saying. Is it actually? Well, only if you don't do standard deduction, technically. But... Uh, anyway. Only if you don't do standard deduction. And then we deduction. had another, another deep episode up, yesterday. So and that'll be on YouTube soon. <laughs> and our next another deep episode is June 8th. So, Dude, it's almost summer. That campaign, that crazy. Yeah, guys? it's basically it's summer. Yeah, it's summer here. It's, it's it's, it feels like summer to me because summer weather. But to like, like to me also the real like summer is when James is out of school because mm -hmm. he's a teacher. So yeah, true. Like the old school yeah, definition. Before like, you know it, of I think school actually it's just got out for us. Again, guys, I'm gonna be sitting here. Dude's gonna be opening his fucking Peppa Pig advent calendar again. Yo, we saw one. Yeah, we in, went. I took them Canada? to the British, the British right, store. We were at Maple Fest, and they were selling in the summer like Peppa Pig advent calendars. I almost bought one to bring to summertime snack bit, just for what? the weirdness of like I have a Peppa Pig advent calendar in fucking May, and I'm eating it. Why? I don't know, man. I can't. just overstocked. I just saw it in the corner. I was like, <laughs> dude, I was like, dude, 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 seen that before? <laughs> how's, the, how's the how's the tattoo, Duke? How's it how's it healing? Oh, hold on. I can't even see my own fucking. <laughs> oh, yo, he's got a little maple leaf tattoo, bro. Yeah. Canada emblazoned forever. Yo, did you find that <laughs> that guy's grandparents? Yeah, no. he found his May grandparents. I mean, maybe, like maybe. The what? tattoo artist of all of get in of all places in fucking like suburban town in Canada. Duke's tattoo artist has grandparents that live in the tiny Welsh town where Duke is from. In exactly my no town. No way. Which like, is wild. Like, like unpr exactly. unprompted. And Duke wasn't only brought, yeah, he said, brought it up. He's like, yeah. oh, yeah. I got people, I got family living in Wales. Yeah. He's like, oh, where? No. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 it was, no, it was, it was, it was crazy. I literally, so one, the owner of the tattoo shop is from Nottingham. Yeah. Wild. Pick up. Um, and I was like, oh, I'm from Wales. And, uh, the, the guy tattooing me is like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have family in literally my town. tiny town. And I'm like, <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, <laughs> and then he starts talking about shit like in my town. Like the, he's like, oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, the like that the half pipe there, like whatever. It's like you were literally on the receiving end of the conversation you had with the guys from Tilburg. That I had yeah. with the guy from Tilburg. <laughs> yeah, except Tilburg has like a population of more than 3,000 people. You know, it's yeah, like... It's, like, it's, it's a, a bit more person. likely. <laughs> yeah, it, it, it was wild. I mean, fucking, what are the chances? And he charged me way too much for this tattoo. Yeah. But, you know, there I it is. I mean, it's in Canadian money, though, so... Uh, Even with the conversion rate. It was 90 pounds, which oh, is like... Yeah, it was like 120 or 100 and something Canadian. Was it because of was it yeah, they charge more because you were walking? It's, it's, it's the, the most expensive the tattoo on this arm. So which is like wild. you know, That's which the considering tattoo. yeah, that is kind of wild. I've yeah. seen fucking Carly's tattoo, bro. Shit looks fucking. 
No. Holly says he was awesome. Holy shit. Holly says he was awesome. If I ever work up the nerve to get the one I've still wanted since I was like 17, I'm going to go to the place where she got it done, but who knows? I'm still a baby. I'm still scared. Actually, I'm kind of wearing a shirt that like I could whip this one out on stream as well. Look at this. Hey, look oh. at that. This was cheaper than the maple leaf. And that's, that's a wild. really fucking good tattoo. That's, like, yeah. that's a good yeah. tattoo. Yeah. Dang. Damn. All right. <clears throat> Anyone else have anything that they want to share before we uh, get going? Uh, I had my first stream back since getting home. Built two shelves. Let's go. Uh, the VOD's out, but it's mostly muted because I was listening to whatever music Bangers the whole time. We'll admit, but, yeah, kind of I'm... down on it, though, because no bulge cam. Dude, there was a lot of bulge. Did you, when I did you check? In, bro, there was a lot of bulge. Did you, you check? The first thing I said when I tuned I, I in. I tried checking like, a lot, to be fair. Oh, I tuned into stream, and the first thing I see is Duke's crotch, I think. First comment. Did, uh, did I just, like, not watch it all the wrong times? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. I'm starting an Elden Ring playthrough tomorrow. So. Not good. Let's go! DLC coming out in what, two yeah. months? One no, month. DLC for one month? It's literally like a month and like four days June? or something. Oh, it was July. Oh, June. June. 21st or 23rd, right? Woo! So, yeah, I'm gonna be playing some Elder Ring tomorrow and like actually, actually like getting the, the vacation deets in because it's hard to talk about stuff when you're building two shells, man. Especially when you manage to yeah. build one of them kind of half backwards. Nice. Yeah. Plastic. Yeah. Were you, were you in... so, oh, I don't need a also, man. On the... Go on, Laura. I was like, if anyone was curious as well, I have some vacation. I haven't posted as much because um, you guys posted them on your Instagram, but I, I posted a selection of the teaser preview wedding photos we've gotten on Instagram. Every time I see one of those posts, I'm like holding my breath. You're like, waiting. Am I crying? No, Am I crying? No, Am I we crying? didn't get any <laughs> pictures of like guests. These are because for the, the, yeah. the, the handful they send us, they're focusing on like mostly once. Yeah, of course. Us, of course. Thing, right? We're not going to yeah. get the rest of them for another like three months or something. But, but being the malignant narcissist that I am, the only <laughs> thing in those albums that matters is if there's a photo of me. You'll know. So. No, the minute we get it, I'm going to put it in the Dungeon Select group chat. So you'll know when the minute we get yeah. that picture. <laughs> no, but yeah, I'm also going to probably Discord, do a... Uh, put, put them on blast. Yeah, I'm going to do a, a also just like the vacation pictures soon on Instagram. But most of them are... You guys have already reposted. I sent them to you guys. And yeah, don't, fuck on, like, don't, don't worry about Instagram like double posting them. It's not like... Yeah. Yeah. What a good ass fucking vacation, but man. There are pictures up, so just check out oh, our various color. Instagrams yeah. if you want to see some highlights from things. Just do it. Definitely. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm running it back next year, bro. I already oh, decided I'm running it back next year. I'm, but I'm going to be in Canada for like three weeks. You know what I mean? Okay. Just I'm going to like. I'm gonna bro. No, no, no. No, no. Maybe next I'm gonna year that'll slide convince in... my mom to rent a pontoon boat for when you're here. Because then I can have I'm going like, to slide into to, to Laura's mom's DMs. Mm hmm. And I'm going to say, hey, listen, do you need someone to look after the lake house while you guys are wintering in Florida? They always genuinely do, and they want people there because they need people to come semi-regularly for insurance purposes. Because, like, say something yeah. happens to the house where they're gone, and if they're like, they can't prove that people I'm are regularly checking saying, on guys. the house. Dude, I'm and then you get, Canadian, you get Canadian, Canadian winter time. We can exactly. go, like, snowshoeing that's, 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 and, that's like, not ice a bad skating idea, and honest. all the Canadian winter time shit. That's, that's not a bad idea. Yo, can we go curling? <laughs> <laughs> that, that would be a bit harder to achieve. I'm sure we could. Bro, I we would do. need... Okay, here's the thing. Okay, Laura, do you need a license to drive a skidoo? I like have a fucking need snowmobile? You need a driver's license. Yeah. You need a driver's license, but I don't because, know if like, to be a Canadian one. I don't, will say... Don't the, don't don't those don't roads up there legitimately because... have snowmobile lanes? Like, yeah. the shoulders my reserved? Mom's, and... where, where we drove to my mom's house, yeah. snowmobile lanes in the winter. And if we're so. up in fucking... In, the wilderness in winter at least like 15 minutes drive from amenities we're either gonna need like snow chains or fucking snowmobiles surely if we're I gonna mean, be out there i've the never winter. put i just have regular winter tires on my car and get around fine but I'll maybe yeah okay i'm genuinely bro if that's something you're doing hit me up because I'll, I'll 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 tag along yeah 100 no that ass dude it's so funny and th okay this anecdote is probably gonna drag the intro on way too long hey, but i was i was talking to my boss i was talking i was talking to my boss before we pad we pad for time so ethan can join and so, this is yeah 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 <laughs> um i was talking to my boss about the whole trip and like how uh, about how uh Lorio parents like winter in florida and he was like oh oh I got i got a story for you okay so he's <laughs> telling me now he's 67 i think and way back in the fucking 70s, when he was like 18, this motherfucker was in New York with his partner at the time, whatever. And he's like, you know, he's a young musician. His partner's a, a young actress and her dad's like a thespian on Broadway or whatever. 
And so they're at these fucking parties, like rubbing shoulders with like these New York socialites. And this couple in like their 50s take a shine to them and they're from Texas, okay? And they're like fucking millionaires that have this penthouse at some huge hotel that like the likes of Donald Trump's there and stuff, yeah. like an apartment, whatever. Mm -hmm. And they did the same thing. They got to stay in this apartment for like six months while this couple were down in Texas for the winter. And it sounded like the best fucking shit ever, dude. Like, you know, when they were done going to fucking coke-fueled parties with <laughs> New York actors and whatever, they were like, yeah, sure, we'll look after your apartment. And like, and it, it's literally like some fucking movie shit where the guy's like, here, have my credit card, and if you need anything, call the limo driver and all of this stuff. Like, it, like That's crazy. crazy <laughs> shit, dude. Crazy shit. That guy's lived a life, man. <laughs> Dude, that's wild. Nice. Lake House was pog. I'll, I'll say, like, yes. th those couple of days that we were at the, like, what, three days or whatever, at the Lake House. Yeah, three days. Girl. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Koi, uh, we'll say if you guys come in the winter time. Caveman. If you come in the winter time, there are no doggies because the doggies go to Florida. Yeah, I mean, it's... yeah, of course. No, of we'll, course. we'll miss Vinny, I guess. Hey, me. Hey, me. <laughs> Let's have Koiba be his best caveman. Build those fires. We just put Koiba on a leash. What do you mean, dude? No, Koiba was living his best life, bro. He's like, you give oh, him, was... you give the man a fire pit, and he's good. You know what I mean? Like, it's crazy. They have three fire pits. <laughs> yeah, but Giving one us was fire gas, pit, and that doesn't count. And we're... yeah, and that was cringe as fuck. <laughs> gas fire pit, cringe. <laughs> I want to burn. I don't get wood. to put. I want to put. I want to almost burn myself. How like, like, how, how, how crazy pit. does that lake? Does that lake like freeze over at all? Like when it's peak winter or? There's those, yeah, because that part's really shallow. Like, you have to go out to the the lake they're on is called like Five Fingers Lake. So there's these five yeah. skinny like offshoots, and then there's like the bigger middle part. So they're on one of the fingers. So the fingers freeze really easily because they're narrow and shallow. The like, big thick part enough to just like freeze. be like, oh yeah, I'm gonna go walk across. Lol. Well, Vinny escaped one time by walking across the lake to get okay, to well, a yeah, dog but on Vinny's the other side. Weight, and then there's so. my weight. Yeah, I. I why? Don't, why did the I dog cross know. the lake? <laughs> I don't know if I would trust like going out full. I don't know why. Yeah, definitely the like on the edges. Absolutely, I don't know if I'd trust as a person. Like that's just that's very hazardous. But I you know it's the worst that could happen. Hypothermia, Pfft. drowning, you die under the ice. <laughs> Well, Dude, that lake thing, was that, that lake was chilly, but yeah. I was genuinely so tempted to do a little where the ladder was, just do a little like cold plunge. Man, shit was fucking cold as hell. I dipped my feet mm. in there. I was like, Whoop. <laughs> and, and then the Whoa, just echoed, like, oh, literally yeah. echoed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's get to it, shall we? Shall we? We shall. Yes. Are we going to fucking Blinker City? I mean, we might, dude. <laughs> Taking us fucking Sippington. Um, okay. So I, I did a little, little recap to kind of jog everyone's memories a little bit of what the fuck are we doing again? Um, upon your return to Eldilon uh, a little while ago, you realized that it was being attacked by two dragons, a black dragon and a green dragon. Uh, you had to flee the city city was being evacuated, and you now uh, lay low in Kalzir, in the Expanse, uh, as a guest of the Empress and the Heroes of Exile. Uh, during your refuge there, you've learned a great deal about the dragons that attacked, and learned uh, also partially through the help of the uh, of Kasuth and, and the other elemental uh, forces, learned that uh, the dragons that you are facing are Tiamat's generals. Uh, and the Nightwebs are basically their uh, personal humanoid army. My Spotify just stopped playing because I'm waffling too much and I thought I'd turn that setting off, but apparently it's, it's cringe. <laughs> <laughs> um, you now stand in front of a humongous task, destroying the five generals of Tiamat. Uh, you decided to take the first to take the fight to the first dragon uh, who resided right there in the Expanse in an area known as the Cataclysm, which functions as a gateway to the elemental plane of air. Uh, in this realm between realms, you found the ruins of a once thriving village, and you headed onwards into the mountains ahead, found Death Jaw's lair, and after a long and dangerous fight, emerged victorious. You returned to Kalzir and now have four dragons to go. Um, you feel a mixture of exhaustion, adrenaline, fear, but also this weird feeling of, oh, we can actually do this shit. And it's, it's all kind of hitting you at once. So as you finish the the ritual, 
take you back to the temple in Kalzir. You all emerge uh, back surrounded by, by some clerics that are doing their daily duties. Uh, it's hard for you to tell what time of day it is at this point because you're inside. Um, but yeah, you feel this 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 mixture of emotions. You tired, but also at the same time feeling very pumped because the adrenaline still adrenaline still rushing through your veins. Scared, but also feeling like we can actually do this thing. Like it's all hitting you at once, and it's 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 a bit much. But um, what would you guys like to do? Uh, I will just like. Sort of gasping, and like, well, thank God that worked. You didn't know it worked. <laughs> it's the first time I've done it, so you know, there's always a chance it couldn't. Didn't think of maybe letting us know that. No, end. it's why would I? It's fine. It would have worked if we ended up somewhere even worse. Or we wouldn't have. It doesn't have that sort of failure. It is. Oh, what, what, what sort of failure does it have? I don't know. <laughs> Taking a coin to spell, there is no chance of failure. It just works. Unless, of course, I haven't set a point yet. But I already did that, so it's fine. I don't know. Well, we're here. We did it. I, once again, am going to have to ask for some help to get this thing back. And point to my still slightly like s like steaming from like charred lightning burns robo body on as the you, ground. As you point, as, you, as the body like looks at it, you'll see like just one of the arms just kind of like in some <laughs> like, springs, kind of, like, just the, the comedy springs yeah, come exactly. out. Like, <laughs> <laughs> which is confusing because Jack's like, I don't put springs in there. <laughs> <laughs> like, Who's been tampering with the machine? The wonder springs. The wonder it broke. <laughs> the wonder. <it> <laughs> What idiot would put springs? Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. I mean, Bro Brooks and Cass can so help last me drag era. it back <laughs> if people yeah. want to go places. Um. Yeah, I'll just I'll, I'll help drag it back to the. Okay. You're going back to Aware like your little, little your little our little base. alcove we got. Yeah, yeah the little, Empress little base uh, we were given. Palace. How um. Fucked up is Davian looking, by the way. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. I will sort of just go, she's like, give us a hand, would you please, Daddy? And I'm like, sort of lean my arm on him. <laughs> Alright, like, how rough are you looking? I'm six on hit points. I'm on six. <laughs> I'm fucked. <laughs> I'm on, uh... I mean, I, can, I, I will cast cure wounds on myself, but like, <laughs> as I'm now, I'm like, <laughs> and you sort of see that, like, I'm He's fucked bleeding up. <laughs> his asshole. Yeah, I'm, I'm out of heals. No, it's alright, I can, I can heal myself, just, oh, I need a second. <laughs> <laughs> hey DM. Hey. I'm just gonna do a second level cure wounds myself. I have a proposition. Right. Princess, oh, I have a proposition. Oh, oh denied. Where you can go now. <laughs> if I attempt to assess Elazarin's wounds yes. with a medicine check, with a DC of your determining. Could I use restorative ointment to the maximum of its potential? Right. So, like, it does it because we. I know we did the whole like you can use an action to get max yeah. healing out of a potion. Well, restorative ointment is an action to use no matter what. Mm -hmm. So it does two d eight plus two hit points. So could I like give him a little look over and then? Use it in such a way that I yeah, might we'll get the maximum benefit. Yeah, we'll just let you roll decide whether or not that works. Uh, okay. So I, uh, I did a level two cure wounds myself. I healed for eight. Nice. Nice. I have a plus five to the roll, by the way. Good. So I rolled Yikes. a two and a one. Good. <laughs> okay. Uh, I got an, I got an eighteen on right. my medicine check. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. Given your, you know, your experience being out in the wild and kind of having to fix yourself up most of the time after whatever, you know encounters you faced when traveling the wilderness, you've gotten uh, quite adept at, uh, you know, not patching up the, the very serious wounds, but definitely the, the, the more, you know, the smaller cuts and licks and that sort of thing. So I'll say that you'll, with the, with the support of, of the ointment, you'll be able to heal. So for cost of uno charge, he is healed for eight 
18 hit points. Nice. Bit that. As I fucking... I am uh, technically still bloodied. <laughs> Look at all your love cuts and also, bruises and fucking like yeah. a little but bit I'm of ointment down, like... here and... Yeah. You... Like, Bandage goes through there. and I'm just like, I don't need to... <laughs> okay. And I'm like, yes, that usually helps. Like, fuck all kind of happens. I'm like... Mm. Like, this is the worst day of my life. Being alive hurts. Yeah. Oh, I'm, like, oh, I'm sure that, I'm sure that's how me and uh, Brooks feel too. Drag yeah. that fucking mess. Yeah. <clears throat> and I was like, thanks, David. Thanks. <sighs> Just. Are you all heading to you know heading to uh, the the Golden Blades base together, or are yeah. people? Are yeah. Yeah. What time is it, by the way, too? As you step outside, you can see that the sun has <laughs> set. Um, oh. Okay. Okay. Uh, it is. It is. It is like early evening. Like this, the people are still out and about. You can still hear the the hustle and bustle coming from the market district. Like the the shops are still open. It's yeah, early evening, seven p.m. -ish. I would say we were in like the temple for a while. So yeah, it's almost time to use a new notebook. I'm so excited. No, yeah, same. Um, I'm also gonna use a third level spell slot. Oh. Okay. To cast invisibility on me and the construct. Okay. So we just look like we're lugging nothing, or like Brooks looks so like he's. Looks like Brooks likely looks like he's just doing. Nothing. And Brooks looks like he's okay. constipated. <laughs> sure, man. <laughs> just avoid some extra attention, man. Okay. Um. Yeah. So you're all. So all of you are heading in the same direction. Yeah. Right? Like we're all traveling yeah. together. Okay. As you uh, head towards, uh, you choose to use the like private entrance that takes you straight in there, or are you going through the main like palace uh, front door? Probably the private. I'm going private entrance. entrance. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, once you enter, uh, the place is pretty much exactly how you left it. And you know, the, the 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 kind of the, the couches and sofas around the fireplace look very welcoming. Yeah. Have. Made it I like safety full sanction I'm on the couches. Straight up, just like I'm over like three of the seats. Like, <laughs> wait, are they two seaters or three seaters? Uh, important. Two three seaters and one two seater. I over one of the three seaters. I'm just like fucking. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> I'm dude. I'm I'm hopping on the fucking two seater. The love seat. <laughs> okay. Fucking me and Oni are gonna take a load off. Just fucking, you know. Dead. Doggo right now. I think so. I think he was a dog in the front. Yes. Yes, he was a dog for the dragon fight, yeah. Can I pet that dog? Um, <laughs> that dog? Okay. Yeah, so you all take a moment to kind of catch your breath and decompress. Um, is there anything you would like to do with your evening, or are you like, fuck everything, this is us. Jax goes and passes out. Hours. Yeah. Yeah, the old man needs his rest. Yeah. Okay. Phones are hurting, man. Oh, let's see I mean, does. I'd probably just be hanging out with Kess since she's been gone for a while, so mm -hmm. we're gonna do the thing where we do, like, super girly shit. We stay up late talking about is, uh, mostly pillow, nothing. Pillow fights and stuff. For, yeah. Come on, boys. Is, yeah. Yeah. Fuck it. What is it? Yorin and uh, Celeste here? Um, this, I... Not right now. Last you heard, no. they were still on their way by Ayers. Right, okay. You don't know exactly when. I'm oh, fucking sweating. If, if, uh, <clears throat> don't say that. <laughs> huh? Don't say that. Um, no, last last you heard, I believe the ship had left. It's like over Thermagar, right? Like it was. Um, no, no, no. So the original destination was Thermagar. Uh, because that was like the first bastion of safety that right. you get to. And then you guys were like, oh, we would like to get some people to come to us. Then they kind of got put in a separate ship and they're making their way here. So, last you heard, they had left Eldilon and by airship from Eldilon to Kalzir is a good wish travel. So it'll be a, be a, a few while. more days. You've been in Calzeria now for what? Two days, maybe? <laughs> two or three. Yeah. Well, spent like two days in Calzeria and then we had like a day trip, I guess. Yeah, so this, day three this, then. this is like your. It's like a third or fourth day, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. 
Somewhere around there. Something like that. This is like your third or fourth. This is like your fourth, like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Perhaps is everybody just uh, doing doing long rest things? No one is doing anything in particular. They're just all boofed to the max. I mean. I think so. Listen, man, what would you do if you just fucking fought a dragon? I probably wouldn't have survived to begin with. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, sleep comes very fast, very very quickly, and you all pass the fuck. And you wake up pretty late the next day. Like you go to bed pretty early, but you wake up pretty late because of just all the exhaustion and some of you took quite a lot of damage. So your your body is is just in complete shut down right now. Wake up around noon. All of you, when when you all kind of begin okay. to emerge from your slumber and then kind of sort of feel ready to have a day or something. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Um, first thing I'll do when I get up, mm -hmm. I'll go back to that main room and assess the construct to see how much it's going to take. To as you get to the main room, I'll say, uh, I, will, I will go help help Jax because I don't sleep as long as everyone else. I, I don't sleep. Period. Yeah. So when I'm done my just like resting i'll be looking waiting waiting by the construct for jack so i can help since it's my my body he has to spend time repairing so i want to help. yeah as uh you know the people that that make their way to the main room you notice that at like the dinner table in that room there is this like s this spread of different types of breakfast food out for you um Yum. some of it may have gone a little cold because it might have been sitting out there for a little that's fair there's, there's still, you know, there's some, there's some food there. The eggs might be cold. It's almost worrying that none of us woke up with them coming in. <laughs> Unless the room for hit dice, can. when you long rest, you recover half of what you used. So if I've used four, I recover two hit dice. Hit dice, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. I have to do everything by hand. Oh, no, I don't even know where hit dice are on the sheet. I'm they only show up on D and D Beyond when you short rest or long yeah. rest, like and it, it does it for you. So that's why I have to do mine by hand. So. Mm -hmm. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yep, yep. Yep, yep. All right, so you're going to try and assess the damage on the. Yeah. See what it'll check take to get it back in the working condition. Uh, make me a, a tinkering check. Hello. I found my new favorite healthy snack. These things are so good. Oh, it's like yogis. It's yogis. like strawberries that have been like dehydrated and then freeze dried in yogurt. They're so good. I mean, yogi. eighteen. Eighteen. Um, you realize that the majority of the damage is, you know, it's pretty superficial. Uh, none of the inner workings have have uh, been. They've had some damage, but nothing is like broken to the point of you have to replace whole ass like inner inner workings. Yeah. Uh, except for one piece. Uh, there's one of the nope. smaller, like, engines that helps the limbs from with, with movement. Uh, seems to have been fully burnt out. So you're going to have to replace that. And then other than that, it's just a matter of getting, you know, getting all the dents out the surface level. Do you reckon time-wise? Maybe a day or two. Depending on how much time you spend. Uh, and then gold costs, just I know. Um, I'm assuming we just need like bits and pieces. I'd be I'd be willing to pay for it with my my gold since it's my body, so you can keep yours for other stuff. Okay. Can't say no to that. <laughs> <laughs> Five hundred and ten. I'll go ahead and give you that. Okay. Yeah, I'll just remove it from mine. <clears throat> That's the one thing I have not looked at at all. Is mm -hmm. your financial situation. I have no idea how much gold. So whenever I know uh, prices, I'm like, eh, I'm sure we'll be fine. Well, we also <laughs> we, we did just get a dragon's sold hoard. all that shit. Yeah, you so did just get a dragon's hoard. hoard. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> so, I mean, I mean, I mean we, we make us like, like four dragons. Our economy's about to be fucked. So, yeah, you true. know. But that means you might be able to get some really cool items, 
It's just uh, you make it so all items suddenly are just more expensive because all these dragon attacks prices have gone up because of inflation and we're like I'm gonna kill myself. And other adventurers are also buying the items. Yeah, fuck. Start time, time currently... to start killing adventure parties. You are I guess. currently in a city where there is a literal guild adventurers. So yeah. <clears throat> but yeah. Time to kill them uh, off. And... What's everyone else doing? All uh, crossing over the or forged. I would like to go and give Davian something real quick. And job. You don't get no. the business. <laughs> no, uh, I am gonna go. <laughs> no. <laughs> Stop, no. It's not a sex thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's a first. Yeah, right. No, uh, I am we'll go through my like bungs. after the conversation we've had about using certain weapons. <laughs> <laughs> the <bungs> uh, <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna go do my. I'm gonna check my, my bag, uh, and I'm gonna pull out Ricard's bow blade. Ooh, and I'm going to like. I got to have like, so you know, he wants to use like a cool sword. I mean, I've had this for a little while. Ricard's bow since blade he, since we fought well, Ricard. Of the items found, cards, little dungeon. Oh. Uh. <laughs> and you can see it's like it's like a short sword and then i'll like uh flick a switch and it turns into a long bow and i'll flick a switch again and it turns back into a short sword i don't remember this at all it's the I same do. dungeon where you all found a bunch of like the trick weapons it was when you guys were fighting yep. ricard it's the same place we got the mall that i you know, use like i nemesis. did i did what was called a yoink maneuver and then never used it because <laughs> it requires attunement and i didn't have a spare slot <laughs> and i've only just remembered <laughs> Should be on. Just take the feet that uh, gives you first slot. Okay. I mean, is it is it on D and D Beyond? So I can just. Yes, yes sir. Should be. Yeah. Made it myself. Oh, oh shit! I got that all purpose, self. dude. I forgot about that. Yeah, Why Wait, is there bacon in the soap? It's a very cool. Well, uh, Invader Zim reference for all the cool kids out there. Hmm. Ricard's bow blade. Yes. This weapon functions as a one-handed short sword with crude edges to inflict bleed. 2d6 slashing damage. Fuck yeah, Wes. The bow deals 2d8 piercing? Yeah, it's... Fucking... Yeah, it's sick. It's a, it's a good weapon, dude. I mean, For some people, to having to choose up. between up close or ranged combat is not an option. Okay. And it's light, so you could. Okay. That's really fucking cool. Mm. That's pretty fucking like good, me. <clears throat> I will pass it over to you. <laughs> like, yeah. Thanks, Lance. Obviously, the wording okay. there is like any projectile shot from a from any arrow fired or will deal 2d8 damage. Whatever damage is allocated to itself. I think on the long bows, it's like what? 1d8. 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 Yeah. This is just better. <laughs> yeah. Better dog. But then. Mm, okay. I mean. Mm, my long bow. Kind of does. Down. Does 1d8 plus 2d6 acid damage, but yeah, I mean, up to you, dog. That's a dragon, though, so it might be worth it for them. And also, maybe it can be turned to a short sword, so, you know, Think black yeah. But then the short sword does 2d6. Mm -hmm. My frost brand scimitar does 1d6 slash and 1d6 cold. Oh, okay, now still, though, like, I think it, it, is, it is good for like if we fight those. Dragons that are like, yeah. immune to that damage. So. Yeah, yeah. It'll That's go in the all. collection. Okay, it'll it'll go in the uh, the efficient quiver. Cool. Hell yeah, brother. <clears throat> Q -Q -Q. Um. Once everybody else is out back in the main room. Um. Excuse me. Um. So we have a few items to identify. I figured I would do it with all of you, so we can figure out who should hold on to them. No. Let's just scroll through the fucking loot list. 
<laughs> okay. And I will start doing my uh, identifies. Mm -hmm. Which I item are you identifying first? That, uh, yep, I'm just pulling up my list. Um, let's start with the spell scroll. Okay. Uh, the first level spell scroll of jump. Uh, is there anyone that wants that? Particularly? It's for the, what's school, of what like class spell list is on. Yeah, I was just about to look. Um, so anyone that is that artificer, druid, ranger, sorcerer, or wizard. So either me or Devian. <clears throat> Do you want it, Devian? Huh? <laughs> yeah? Should I? <clears throat> maybe I'll I'll type these two in the chat so then if Belle sees it and if she wants them, she can message us so then Kes oh. can grab it. But uh... Oh, yeah. Um, spell right, scroll well, I just... jump. Yep. Does Davian want a spell scroll of jump? Cast the jump spell one. We go far. Yeah, go on then. I think I have some. Spell scrolls are as well. We can we can go in my collection, I guess. Hell yeah. Uh, all right. I guess we'll move on to the medium chest armor. Uh, okay. Uh, that medium chest armor is elven chain. Is elven chain like really good? Uh, elven chain. It basically means you don't have to have the weight, uh, the strength. Yeah, requirement. I was gonna say that's actually get, like the really disadvantage. Nice yeah. Oh, I know that because I see. I think so. Proficient yeah. with the armor, even if you lack the proficiency with medium uh -huh. armor. Yeah. And I see. It does, and it does not require it. attunement, so anyone not proficient with medium armor can still use it and gain the. It doesn't. That, yeah, it's, that'll be great for someone. Um, I don't need it personally, and I don't think Elasmer does either. No. Nope. I think it's also. Um, I think this also doesn't have the disadvantage on stuff. I think it, it does not. Do it. Okay. Because the the way the item description reads, um, allows the sound of the rings rubbing against one another to be muffled by outer light. But that tells me that it doesn't. It, it doesn't light. tell you that you have disadvantage, so I would assume you don't. Oh, no. What's Maybe. the what's the what's the AC? AC is fourteen. Uh, but it also says you gain a plus one bonus to AC, so it may be actually be fifteen. I'm not sure. AC fifteen. I mean, uh, I'll it's take what, it, I'll, I'll, until you equip on your character. So. Yeah, I'll take that. Quickly equip it. See, it doesn't require too much anyways. Either way, it's higher than mine. Perfect. Awesome. Um. All right. Let's so move on to the vial of oil. I'm actually uh, interested about this one. Oil of sharpness. Ooh, that's pretty sick. Yeah, if y'all just like close on me for a second. Oh. Here, gelatinous oil uh, coats one slashing or piercing weapon or up to five pieces of slashing or piercing ammunition. Flying the oil takes a minute. Uh, for one hour, the coated item is magical and has a plus three bonus. That's, three That's bonus. correct. It's good. So it's a, it's a very rare. Shit. Oh, shot is very rare. Fucking hell. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's pretty crazy. <laughs> just... Wait, I mean, it makes sense. Well, uh, like... Lazarin, would you maybe want this for your dragon's thing? Oh, I think... Let me just double check something. <laughs> Basically makes it a an additional plus for one, is what it's going to do. I mean, uh, somebody just keep well... it for... Well, no, it'll give you an additional plus three regardless. Oh, is it plus three regardless? It's just plus yeah. three to your bonus oh, so, attack. Sorry, I missed that. I thought you said it makes it a plus three as in like... No, 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 no. It's it, an extra it plus, plus three. three. Oh, it's added plus three. That's why three. it's so good. <laughs> right. I understand now why it's very rare. This makes a lot more sense. <laughs> cool. Sorry, I just like misunderstood. I'm like, what? Uh, yeah, just, okay, then in, in that case, then, with that yeah, understanding. I, I'm just yeah. saying, since that deals big damage to dragon, dragons, it's good yeah, to it's have it hit having. more and do more damage. Yeah, not too worth. Yeah, is it plus three to damage as well? Yeah, plus yes. three to attack. Plus three to attack rolls and damage rolls. 
That's what I'm saying, Pog. Good man. So, yeah, I have, an, I have an AC override, and I'm trying to figure out why I do not. We. I also have one. I think we got it from something. I don't know. Right. What. You think so? No, but in the sense of like. In the you past, think we would get it from you, something? No. It. No. It was. Who the fuck gave us this plus one? It's not really fucking stupid. I uh, think... was it on the potions? Was it on the potions that you like, gave us such? Did the... they... that? Um... It's just been like one of my infusions at some point too. I don't remember, dude. No. It's been a while. That's what I'm saying. Like you, your one just gave me lightning resistance, right? That's all. Yeah, it just did. got rid of it. That's, that currently you just have lightning resistance. Get rid of it because the, yeah. the, the the things that I remember giving you, no, would have run out by now. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So. And if, and if we're wrong, we'll fucking how we'll put it back, you know. Yeah, see, I, I have to go through my infusions anyways today because it's, it's been a while. I don't remember, so I just get rid of it. I don't have to change up infusions I have on everything. I remember like the times I did give you like a global like buff. It had like a yeah. set, like okay, it, this runs out after six months. Yeah, I don't remember where this came from. I think it, it must have been like I remember us all being like, oh, fuck it out. run it back, uh, Bell. When you when you watch that episode, <laughs> tell us what it was. <laughs> but then you won't know until this episode to do it. But when you do yeah. it, let us know. <laughs> so in seven years' time, mm. let me know, okay? Right. Next! All right. Uh, the potion. Uh, a potion of vitality. Go on, sell it again. We love those. Go, Gib, I'll sell it again. <laughs> Dude, I'm not giving that to you. I am just going to put that back in the bag. Don't trust the Lazarin with it. I mean, honestly... Might just end up selling it, but I don't know. We'll see. We have not needed it. it is, okay. Yeah, I know. But if we, someone gets exhaustion, though, it's but just we so might need it. Good, we dude. might need it soon. I'll be honest. That's that's my thing. Is like removing exhaustion is just so so good. Nice. Yeah, dude. I now I'm just confused. What? So, <laughs> so I remove the AC override. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And then I'm like, okay, so I have studded leather plus one. Which like sets my, days. which sets my AC to thirteen. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Plus my dexterity bonus mm -hmm. makes it sixteen. Okay. Plus the mag pl plus the bonus from the staff of power right. makes it eighteen. Right. Yeah. Right. So I take the studded leather off. Mm -hmm. Goes down to fifteen. Put the elven chain on. Right. The max bonus from dexterity is only a plus two. Plus two so on the medium armor. Yeah. Right, so it's the same. Oh, but this one it's looks cooler. <laughs> it's I say worst case, way. We, if one of the other people want it, you can always just pass it off. Yeah, I have no idea. What Kess Kess is, I have no idea what Kess's armor situation is, for instance. I, I have no idea what Kess's item situation is. So. It's true. Yeah. yeah. So uh, fuck knows. Because yeah. she probably, yeah. Kess is probably lacking in the items department because anything it's six yeah, months of no loot. True. True. So. True. <laughs> so, uh, just uh, you know. Put that on the on the pile. Yeah, so we'll, fuck that bitch. You should yeah, be here. <laughs> it's in Discord, so like, yeah, you know, we'll, we'll get it figured out. All right, next. All right, uh, the wand. The wand of lightning bolts. Oh, that's so good. Right, food. Got a lot of fun um, shit from a dragon dude. Fuck, dude. I mean, the thing is, like, this is good for anyone, really. Mm. Mm. Oh, get the dragon. A fucking absorbs it and just has fucking lightning bolts she shooting up. Bolts out of her she could Iron Man. I she turns to Iron Man. Oh, true. Uh, yeah. Let's go. I mean, I would, I would replace of the enchantments I have. I'd probably replace Big B's hand with the lightning bolts. Mm -hmm. Because my problem is, I don't have a lot of things that are, are expendable anymore in terms yeah. of because I'm, really? I've, I have consumed five enchantments, and one of them mm. is the circlet of non-detection, which we need yep. for being scryed on all the time. Yeah. The claw of the worm rune, which is specifically mm -hmm. for dragons, that yep. whole situation. So I'm not getting rid of that. Mm -hmm. The night web detector, not getting rid of that. So all that's left are the big beast hand or the mage hand gloves. And the mage hand gloves seem silly, but it's the only way I can touch things that will. That's a so good I kind of want to keep yeah. it. Yeah, and I don't want to get rid of it. So the only that's one that's funny. like really. So the question is, would the lightning bolts be more useful than big beast hand potentially? What's the or... exact. So I one of lightning bolts. Brooks so it has seven them. charges. Yeah. While holding it, uh, you use an action to expend one or more charges to cast the lightning bolt spell. For one charge, you cast the third level version, and each charge you 
choose to use ups the level uh -huh. spell level by Okay. I'm tossing it 10th uh, level. Could also be good for Kess, though, too. The wand regains 1d6 I mean, plus 1 charges daily at dawn. Yeah. If you expend the if, wand's last charge, roll d20 on a 1, the wand crumbles to ashes. So you won't. Or in this case, my enchantment would fizzle. Yeah. yeah. I, I'd say if Kess doesn't want it, I'll take it and replace because I haven't been rolling very well with Big B's hand. Yeah, like, it also true. says required to do by a spellcaster, well. <laughs> but, but for the sake of this, if yeah. Diagon like, sucks up the enchantment, we'll they let you go. Yeah. Technically. Uh, well, I was going to say, like, oh, maybe it would be good for, like, Brooks to have a ranged thing, but it would mess up his rage anyways, so mm -hmm. it wouldn't matter. Yeah, exactly. He can't use it whilst raging. Yeah. can't use magic limbs. Yeah. yeah. So it wouldn't, it wouldn't oh. matter. Hmm? Sorry. I just I was trying to type. I'm putting this Can in I the hope? chat for uh, Ethan and Bell. <laughs> no. So I just said, if, if, Cass doesn't, if Cass doesn't want it, I'll take it, but we'll wait to see when mm -hmm. Cass is here. If she does. I'll yeah. hold on to it for now, but I won't consume the enchantment off it, so that way... Imagine she's like, I want it, actually. I'm like, okay, here. Haha, -ha. <laughs> just kidding, and just, I don't tell her, just, I've it's, already... <laughs> it's just a fake wand, yeah. Yeah, I don't tell her, I've already right. consumed the magic from and it. I think the last thing on the list is, ring. is a ring, which is a ring of yep. evasion. Hmm. That fucking required a wait, tuning, doesn't wait, it? Wait, do we have two of these now? Am I crazy? Yeah. Real quiet, we got like... I mean, I just, I did not pick hand pick any of these items except for the all-purpose no items. i know I, it's just, just funny that that was that you dragon end up rolling Horde, that all loot generator you know what i mean i just, I just fill in oh, yeah the level the party is that fought the dragon mm -hmm. and pulled this that's a only, useful tool if only i had my six attunement slots man <laughs> fuck i only need Requires seven levels for that it's fine requires attunement you yeah, hate to that, read it you yeah hate to yeah <laughs> Because right. fuck so, him, it's so good. I'm going to assume no one's going to be using that because I don't think anyone was using the other one at the moment. I mean, I would want to use it. But bro, you need two minutes to use it. I mean, bro, I don't need the heart of land. Fuck that, I am right. I'm just upset. I yeah, fucking, it makes you get fly. Uh, I just, I can fly anyways. Oh, it means I can actually fly. True. Yeah, because you've got us down the ground. Right, and other than that, all the other stuff in there is not, ma sense. not magical, but just a bunch of fucking jewelry and other stuff. Yeah, the shit to to sell. The <clears throat> jewels, I'll go up to Jax. Um, Jax, could you, using the gems we have, could you make us a gem encrusted bowl? Oh, ooh, that's so I can smart. help encrust. I can help that's encrust clever. it. I was like, you're a gemstone guy, I surely you can. I can, I can encrust it, yeah, but could you help me? I have jeweler's tools as well, too. And, yeah. well, actually, I have that all-purpose tool that can I mean, I have me. jeweler's tools, and I have jeweler's tools anyway. Yeah, but now he has the all-purpose tool, which he can just turn yeah. into jeweler's tools. Like, he has every tool yeah, just, yeah. available. Yeah, yeah. But, like, shit. And it makes yeah. him super sick. Okay. We just need to f okay. we just need to find a bowl to, you know, encrust them onto. We could probably do that. Okay. Yeah, fuck you, DM! <laughs> Yeah, I'm paying a thousand gold for this. That's really creative. I said that's dope, actually. Right. Yeah. I've been thinking about this shit for a month. <laughs> that's like adding it up and it's always. Dude, that's making me like look and see if I actually have some of their gems sitting around. Uh, dude, I could, put, I could put all these diamonds in there. No, don't 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 you even lie about that. Need for other things. Yeah, got, unfortunately. You jet, you got like three pieces of jet. You got two black pearls, four yellow well, sapphires, all from that dragon. Technically. Technically, with the yeah. poles, we could do it. Really? No way. Is that no way? I don't know if the well, golden amount. All really the costs doesn't necessarily or... need to come from the jewels themselves, but yeah. Yeah. The cost I get a, like the gold I get a, or whatever the bowl. I get, I get a, like a gold bowl, you know. I get whatever. a bowl that's worth a thousand gold, but like it's not gem encrusted, so I just have to put like dollar store gems just, on it, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, like bedazzle it. You, you like yeah. put some of these sh these things yeah. on there and yeah. just be like, boom, like, problem solved. It's gem encrusted, guy. <laughs> Uh, I'd say that from, right. you know, I'd say, you know, you can have to try. try. If I've got some onyx, if we need to bust I mean, up, we but... could probably make at least three, right? Now, if, does a goblet count as a ball if no. I take off the fucking handle? No, <laughs> take a off fucking the goblet, you knob. <laughs> oh, no, go goblet! Dude, I think we could actually make four bowls. Well, what? The, gems. The, well, the I total don't, value I... has to be a thousand gold. Yeah, I yeah, don't yeah. know. But if from all the gems, gems we have like four thousand golden gems. Okay, just, yeah, okay. Just making sure that you're like aware that like you yeah. have to yeah, put yeah, a thousand yeah. gold worth of gems on that. If you're going to a shop and be like, oh yeah, I'll buy this 
tutor bowl, would it? Don't no, we'll definitely bowl? spend. We'll definitely. We'll, we'll spend some money on the bowl, bro. We don't want to. I'll, I'll carve the bowl out. out of a tree right nearby. You know. Yeah, you can do that though. You can you can cut down the tree, carve it, and like. But uh, yeah, I mean, shit, that's a cool idea. Oh, fuck. Hell yeah, that's bro. Really as much as I would love to just wear that ceremonial electro dagger. Fuck. What? The ceremonial electro dagger that we have. Dude, you can have it. I know, but it feels stupid to just wear it around. Also, with an electro dagger, the second you fucking stab anything with it, just like. <laughs> it's it, it, well, it's low. ceremonial. It's literally ceremonial. <laughs> so, I mean. Does it still have the, the lovely property of gold. I really meant to stab someone with it. True. Still be so fun to do. All though. the items then to find. Um, there we go. You guys have a lot of shit to sell. You guys have time to kind of blow off some steam. You guys, you guys, you know, you have a a, a robot to fix. Uh, there's a lot of stuff. For you guys some jewelry to work to do. <laughs> yeah, I will. I am gonna go bowl shopping. We do not have to RP this because fuck me, I'm not gonna be like. I need one. I, how many how many bowls do you want? I'll grab. We could make Jack, it four or five. Jack mentioned four. I will sure buy get four. Some nice like silver ones. I so yeah. I will try and find expensive. some. I basically want to find mm. ones that are like pretty decently priced. I'd say maybe like at most a hundred gold each, but, but aiming for like fifty. Um, and ones that I could definitely look like I could in like it'd be easier for me to um encrust with so stuff that's like not too ornamental already because like that's gonna be a fucking pain in the ass to deal so with definitely looking for something metallic slash like you know gold yeah gold. yeah yeah uh yeah just say just spend 200 gold and say you bought four done. silver bowls. done like they're 50 cool. gold each yeah perfect um what did you guys want to do with the gold bloodstone ring and the large gold bracelet can I just wear the bloodstone ring? I was gonna say, if you want it, like, yeah, I feel free. Like, I. I mean. Well, I wear the bracelet. Fuck it. I have a little bracelet. Okay. Oh, you got. Jewelry man needs jewelry to wear. Thanks, Link. Got too... too many rings already. Backing yourselves out with some jewelry. Drip. Bloodstone ring. Uh. Worth 250 gold. It's an expensive ring. Damn. That's more than on, like, the salary of most of the people will ever make in their lives. also worth 250 gold. Yeah. <laughs> what is a bloodstone? Oh. This one's pretty cool. An opaque, dark, grey gemstone with red flecks worth 50 gold pieces. The bloodstone ring just isn't... isn't... I can't add it to my inventory, so I'll just... No, I just add it as a custom item. item. The other possessions... They're also called blood jaspers. Yeah. Because in real life, they look cool. Thanks. Anyone else want to do anything in particular today? Or are you guys kind of just vibing uh, through the day? I will start, like, the process of encrusting. Okay. Are you proficient with your uh, jewel? Uh -huh. I am indeed. I am indeed. Okay. Um, Make me a... Make me a sleight of hand check and add your Oh god. You're doing, you know, you're doing... That was almost so good. I'm so upset. It's an eight. Eight? You you begin working and you kind of realize that man, it's been a while since you've done this. Yeah. And it's been a good while. <laughs> like, the, this first attempt goes nowhere. You don't damage anything. But this first yeah. attempt, you're just kind of like... Pfft. Uh, and you kind of realize that, like, you're going to need to kind of get back into to the swing of things. Decide to maybe give them another crack. Yeah, I'm like, I'm there, I do the fucking, like, try and do it, I'm like, fuck! <laughs> Watch some tutorials on YouTube. Yeah, 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 the refresh one. That's how we go. It's been a while, it's been a while. It's been a while. Uh, um, I'll go pick up the uh, materials for... Uh, the contract repairing. Okay, so you're going... Are you going to see... Are you going to buy the materials, or are you going to go check with the Heroes of Exile to see if they got some shit? Like that? Yeah. Ooh. That is where you last repaired. That's a good point. We could get some free shit from them. 
Yeah, fuck it. I'll go. I'll go wander over there. Okay. Um. I'll I'll go with Jax. Okay. Hell yeah. Not doing anything else. As you wait. Uh, oh. Real quick. Mm -hmm. So I have Death Joe's visage. Now. While you're wearing no armor, if you have Death Joe's visage, visage equipped, you can add your charisma bonus to your armor class. So would that mean that I would have my dexterity bonus and my charisma bonus? Yes, yeah. yeah, so, it would just be instead of whatever base AC is. Yeah. So my AC would be the same because I would have plus three for my dex, plus three for my charisma, plus two for my staff of power to make it 18. Because again, I have no idea. Oh, wait, didn't we get some kind of blessing or something or buff? Like there was like a, a thing before we went to fight the dragon that was like, hey, and that's why our AC was 20. Maybe. I feel like it was yeah. around the same time that we saw the, the prophecy thing. Or, or, or it was it was the Earth Boy maybe that we went to see before we went to fight the dragon. I don't remember. Or it was because something like that. But anyway, someone buffed. May, it, I think I think it may have been Kusuth oh. that kind of gave you. A I boon think it might have like been Kusuth, like fight. a boon. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I say I don't um, have a boon, so it must have been something on your end. So, anyway, that would that does would, Death Jaws? Yes. I see. You don't need armor at all. Can I, so yeah, can I just can I attune to Death Joel's visage? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I would like everyone. Fuck. I oh god. It. Oh no. <clears throat> oh, you're not deafened. You're muted. You're fucking I fucking pressed on one. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you you know because this 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 mask. As it were helmet slash mask it's just in the shape of a blue dragon head mm. you kind of look at it for a little while and then you begin to put it on suddenly you kind of have this vision you have a vision where you tower over this 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 castle and beside you are four other dragons the other four okay uh, and you can see piercing through the clouds and the clouds kind of break apart and you see up and there's this large tear in the sky you can see through the tears this this hellish fire this five-headed dragon kind of reaching through the veil it's just looking at you the four other dragons mm -hmm. make a perception check Fifteen. As you look up, and she gets closer and closer, and like you get, it gets to the point where where Tiamat is like in your face. This this feels very surreal. Um, this doesn't feel like something that happened in the past. This kind of feels of some kind of shared vision these dragons may have had, like a remnant of that memory kind of lingers in this mask. And as mm -hmm. Tiamat's blue head specifically uh, kind of almost gets so close you can feel its breath kind of brushing you in the face. You can see on top of the blue head Ooh. standing someone that looks a lot like Brooke. But a more feral version of Brooke. Curled horns. Have like deep yellow eye, gnarly, almost like fang. Do his features look more uh, devilish or more draconic? Devilish. Okay. And as you see that, you just kind of snap out of it and get the room again. Put the helmet on. Return to it. it. Seems that just in the attunement process, you kind of were able to get a glimpse of a sh some memory that linked.
Okay. So... Is Davian alive? <laughs> yeah, I'm good. I'm vibing. Yeah, the other... No, Soko's oh, last. I didn't say it. I did not say it, sorry. <laughs> Fine, you're still not last. Soko's... Yep. Soko's not ready yet. <laughs> Duke. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was looking at my inventory. My bad. My bad. My bad. Uh, body of me in the ball and blow. So are you bad. putting that thing on in front of us? Like, while we're doing loot? Well, loot how long does it take to attune to something? Like an hour. Uh, like isn't an it an hour? hour? Right? Like a short yeah. rest of the day? I guess you're doing that while yeah. we're off. Like, we left to go get materials yeah, you know, and stuff. Lazarin went we, ball shopping, uh, whatever. We go out shopping, we come back, Davin's dead. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You are now wearing a very badass blue dragon head. <laughs> okay, well that that leaves us with a whole other thing after we've already just got through all of this fucking shopping and whatnot. But now I have two sets of armor that I'm not going to use. Oh boy. <laughs> um, in the uh, elven, what was it? Elven chain okay. and and the plus one studded leather. We could probably give the elven chain to Kess, I think. She's uh, it also means that unless I unattune from my cold sword, I can't attune to the sword that you just gave me. Fucking hell. Uh, I also still have these... Are fighting cold dragon decks, though? I also still have the crystal dragon wing hand crossbows. The closest dragon to you location-wise would be the green dragon. Forest. Oh, in the Whispering Woods, right? Mm-hmm. Enderman. That would be the, the closest one. Too. Wait, do close, so Can I do like a Skyrim and like put? Do we have any display cases? Like, in <laughs> sure. The... Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, sure. Puts, yeah, uh, because put your stuff up uh, to showcase. Like, I am kind of just tired of having all this stuff in my inventory, but I also don't want to go to the lengths of selling my two hand crossbows. Mm -hmm. um, would you like us to just sell them for you? No, you, can, you know no, there'll I be some killed... there'll be some display cases. I killed some... Strahd with those hand crossbows you know, or some, whatever uh, we did. They are, they some, are armor stand, some armor stands where you guys can choose to put up some armor or some weapons that like serve their purpose, but not currently in the rotation. Yeah, sure. That's fun. Oh yeah, I'll um... put my rapier of warning up. Huh? I'm a like I'm a I'm a big slut for that sort of stuff in Skyrim. My house is always full of just shit. I'm a big like, slut. You know, like all the all the like yeah. Daedra, Daedra Lord weapons and stuff are just all in display. And I never saw that. Dude, shit. I wish there was like in the campaign a shared like chest of like. Oh, it'd be so good. These are all the items that I don't want in my inventory, but we still have. You know. Oh, yeah, I wish like, there was like, like in, a you in could... the beyond, just like a like, yeah. yeah. I mean, I guess like, you could, a cool feature. You could make, we, you could make a spreadsheet, and you know, be, have like if um, you want, I will make a spreadsheet of this shared we'll shared storage, right and it could, just say that could the shared storage a, is always a okay, new character that's just yours. called inventory, and we just put all the fucking shit in there. That's cool. all that guy does. Oh my god! Just uh, like a shared Here, storage, I'll... and we'll just basically say that. Wherever you guys are currently calling home base is where the shared storage is. Whether it's you know back in Elbilon in your house or here or hmm. what opposed. Alright. In that case, you. okay, I'm just gonna DM DM soak up the stuff that I need and we cool. can we can yeah, move on in no time. If anyone else has anything else, just so DM it make to like me a, add the spreadsheet as we go. Because in the spreadsheet what you can do is like have like columns with all the party members' names, chuck shit in there. What, who, what that was my plan. We have a similar Love thing. Love me a good us. spreadsheet. We have a, we have a similar thing going for a different thing. <laughs> because that DM is a dickhole and actually ah. is the encumbrance mechanic, so we can, we physically can carry a bunch. Like, fucking excuse me? Yeah. Imagine having Doing the right with... mind would you uh, actually use mind. Full power. Man. It's rough. Man. Oh, it's rough. I, yeah, I just had deja vu. Stylish. I just I had deja so vu. Wrong. Holy <laughs> shit! I swear, we've done that like exact thing before. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> Even on the same word where yeah. Koiba fucked up and we both went main. <laughs> yeah, it, it, happened, a lot. it happened like an hour ago as well. I'm like a different thing. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are dickholes. Okay. There, um, okay, there are a couple things that I do want want to sell but i'll just dm them to you dutch and you can 
send me the let me know the shekels. Sure. So we come home from shopping. Hmm? What the fuck do we see with Davian? Yeah. Um, Davian is sitting. Oh, nothing new. To sit, but he's wearing a blue dragon head. Is it like an actual head, or is it like it's a mask? It's it's a mask, but it's like it's a mask, so it's like a dragon, blue dragon face. Does the does... mouth open up and you see his head in like the dragon's like mouth? Is that how it works? Do I have a picture? Yeah, it's dragoon armor. You can toggle it so it like opens up and closes. Sec. And the eyes sometimes um, glow blue. Yes, of course. Oh, I don't gain a breath weapon. That's a shame. No. I mean, we could just get you a potion for that. Yeah. There literally the potions of dragons. Guys, imagine how dope That's this should have been if Nicole had it. And I went full Tiamat instead of Chromatis. Hey, you fucked up. No, I don't think I did. I feel like I made the right choice considering I could turn into a dragon. That was pretty fucking cool. And also that weapon, that item was so OP, it's ridiculous. That yeah, Dutch but Nicole was cringe, so... Dutch actually had to actively nerf it within a day. Yeah, <laughs> He's like, did. that's ridiculous. Hang on. I was on crack like, This is what it looks effect. like. Uh, so, like, this is what Davian is currently wearing on his head. Oh, I, I, I got you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's cool looking. Oh, it kind of cool. looks like, uh, like a Rhyhorn. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Cool. Nice headgear, Devin. Thanks, me! Sorry. Did we identify this at the fight? Or no? Um, I We definitely know what it does. Because... Yeah, we know what it does, right? Yeah. Right. I think I identified that one while we were there. Maybe. Yeah, I wouldn't. Yeah, I think so. Because we're like. It sounds like something I would do. It's just like, what the fuck is this? That doesn't sound. Hmm. Probably not the best to have done it when we weren't here, but you know. <laughs> well, I mean. Oh, I mean, I'm sure like someone was here. Like maybe Brooks was here, right? I mean, every, you know, the whole. You know, it took an hour. You guys are taking it. To I was just thought, you know, I'll save some time, get it out of the way. Yeah. Seems a little risky, how at all. No. Oh, big, no. Big, big, like, does my passive insight, like, oh, fucking cut through with this With your man. throbbing passive insight. Well, what are you looking yeah, for? Yeah, 20. Like, what are you looking for? This, I've said, like, he's like, Hit me with like a no, <laughs> like how he has said it. It's a little okay. What are you looking for? Like, he... what specifically I'm lo are you I... looking for? I'm looking for, I don't think because he said like everything's fine. I don't think everything's fine. Okay, is he lying? Make Not a... even like, is he lying? Okay, this, man... With... This, this man has said, like, we know what this does, we know it's like not great. Like, what but since okay, well, we know it's since not that great. what you're looking for. Uh, yeah. With your passive insight, Davian looks fine. Okay. He seems That's fine. fine. Cool. Nothing. That's fine. Seems, That's nothing what I was talking about. Just seems to be. Yeah. There's no difference. That's what I was mainly. Like, I wasn't like in his, his words. It was just I was like, he's just got like this is fine. The item seemed a little sketchy. I, That's like the one thing I recall us being a little like over it. But he seems okay. Then yeah, that's yeah, no, fine. Seems... Like I don't see like any like weird right. markings like where he's put the hat. There's like some like attached to his fucking skin or something. It's mainly what I was like looking. Cool. That's fine. Okay, if everything's fine, then, you know. Um, I mean, you know, absolutely, you know, I'm feeling fine, I'm doing fine. Uh, all good, but I did have a vision. You know, that bit's not fine. <laughs> I mean... Of? Uh, it felt like I, it was from the perspective of um, the dragon in question, Death Jaw. Felt oh, like okay. I was sort of in, in, you know, and hanging out with my dragon friends. And then the sky opened and a big five-headed dragon 
poked its five heads down. And the blue head, like, came in really close. Mm. Uh, and who did who did I see on top of it? Uh, oh. oh. Well, it, uh, again. It, it was Brooks. It was Brooks. It was Brooks? Yeah, well, that's just more of the same. Like, again, we saw that's already been prophesized, but on something that, again, was fluid. So it's just... To me, it's just another... Yeah, but multiple sources confirming. It. Like, that feels a little Come corroboration. On, Gavin, you don't love this, that, right? This, this this vision you had didn't feel like something that specific... It, it, it... Make an insight check for me. Me? Yeah. I'm trying to see if you can... Whoa. Natural one. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. Carry on. Okay. Well done. <laughs> Hmm. Well, I am choosing to put no weight to this. That's just... Now, I felt, I, his, it felt almost like a memory. Like it had mm -hmm. happened already. But it hasn't, though. And Deathjaw's dead now, so it can't happen ever. I mean, well, that's not... what I mean. It's like it felt like that's something that has happened. I feel like already. we would know if Brooks had already defected. Well, see, like, imagine Brooks, Brooks, but, like, you Ooh. took I figured it out. the, like, devil part of Brooks and, like, made it way, like, whoa. That's, but it was... Brooks Does Brooks is... have an evil twin? I was gonna say, that's the answer! Guys, Brooks has a twin! That's the answer. An ancestor, maybe? Yep. Or, or like... Uh, no, Brooks, he is a twin, 100%. Brooks is fucking... Does that make sense? Dad or whatever he, he's has another... He is wanted in that other province. Wait, and did, wasn't there someone using his name or something <sighs> recently? Like, there was things happening, and he's like, wait a minute, that was after I left. And even Brooks was confused. Guys, guys, at first I was like kind of half kidding, but now I'm like, for real, Brooks has a twin. <laughs> yeah, but was Brooks the right done? Brooks, though? Oh my god. Well, he doesn't look oh, no. like the guy in the vision that felt like a memory, so I have a feeling that he, the Brooks is the right Brooks. For the sake of this conversation, Brooks is still not back from whatever errand he did, so we're having this before yeah. he gets back. And then when he gets back from break, he'll actually get back from his in-character whatever he was fucking doing. Literally like, Brooks over twin! <laughs> he just, he doesn't right. sit there doing yeah, we're, like, <laughs> we're in vomit when he gets back. I'm, well, yeah. I think we need to have a little sit down and just like probe about me. Oh, do you have any siblings? Like, no. But he probably doesn't know. Like he could have well, no, it. It. It's like well, If I was Brooks, was Brooks adopted, or was it just his Wait, brother? Was hold on, no, Yoren's a human though, right? Brooks, yeah, Yoren was adopted. You know, you know Brooks siblings. is adopted. Like Brooks' dad. Yeah, yeah. Brooks is adopted. Is... Yeah. So his uh, other yeah. his twin could have been adopted. Could have been adopted to separate, like families. Yeah. That happens all yeah. the time. Hundred percent. Yeah, but then isn't there like some weird thing that happens between twins that are separated that they like know and they like communicate? Like, what not if he always. does know and he's just not telling us? No, you're thinking of you're thinking of psychic twins. These are just regular twins. Easy we don't stick. know that. <laughs> I've met Brooks. I've met. Brooks. I mean, <laughs> there's not that. Come on, there's not, not that much he's going not. on up there. Yeah, there's, there's there's one no too way. many punches in the head for that man to be a psychic. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, psychic doesn't necessarily denote intellectual capacity again one too many punches in the head that rattles whatever's in that fucking brain man <laughs> he is um not all there shall we say no i'm just saying if anyone was going to be hiding a secret twin that they knew about this evil but didn't want to tell i us. think he doesn't know because he also seemed confused when he caught word of that his alias was being used but it was after he left like, even he but he's like i'll deal with that later then how did the and twin he... know the alias if he... he probably doesn't. The twin might have seen, like, maybe the original wanted posters were for Brooks because Brooks admitted he did some shady shit. But then the twin no, was but like, the name, oh. the name was definitely yeah, but if one the of Brooks' aliases. And then realized maybe the, if, if the other twin has found out that he is a twin before Brooks, like, Brooks doesn't know if this one's found out. Yeah. He's not, like, I'm going to use this to my advantage and now I'm going to pick up where my other twin left off and do all the shit that I'm going to do that is less than on the up and up. But now using this identity that my long-lost sibling has created. I reckon fucking 
Devil Man Crybaby is better friends with Brooks is a strange dad than Brooks is, and Brooks is a strange dad being, you know, fucking big devil man is like no stuff and he's like hey you should go and pretend we to be him wait we didn't brooks have this vision sounds... well, also it would mess with us because then this could be their way to try and also like break us apart from the inside they're sending us these visions so that we think it's brooks and then maybe we because that's how then they screw us over because if we like shunned him because if we immediately believed it we're like no you're evil get away from us and then it makes us weaker and we can't do our job yeah, but didn't Brooks just have visions himself of? His vision didn't have to be of him. Like my visions weren't of me. Devils. I never once saw myself in any vision I had. Yeah, I he... saw you guys, and I saw other Tabaxi, and I saw the Elemental Lords. I never saw myself. But he saw. Tim. He saw someone who looks like him. No, yeah, but he still saw the dragon, though. Yeah, like... I also saw again things tied up in this whole mix. But all the visions are not isolated to only seeing ourselves. Uh, well, Brooks would... is the grandson of that uh, devil lady, uh, Glaucoma. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, Jax, that's what you have. That's different. Oh, right. Brooks saw... <laughs> it's like Glistry okay. or something, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, Brooks okay, saw okay. an individual say... that looked like him among the... As someone whose family tree is kind of a circle, right? Do make I understand? A, make a religion check. <laughs> Uh, the, the, the last one. So, All I'm saying how is, well do you know your devil? my religion's pretty good. Is it? The oh, well, bad I... news. <laughs> I have like plus five to my religion. Okay, religion I've got plus two. Okay. Well, my, mine's a giant ten. Okay. I know more about gods than I do devils. Why? Uh, seventeen. Okay, Jax. When you mention, you know, glaucoma, Lassia, <laughs> begin to think, and <laughs> that's funny, Lassia. Is the daughter of Morius. Yep. Yeah. Yamat was, or perhaps still is, or not was, kind of Asmodeus's pet. There is a link. So, and Asmodeus there is a link Jesus. to Brooks's devilish heritage and Tiamat, being that they both serve Which again... the same. But there is a link. So there. we need to kill him. Well, could still work with the twin theory, because also think about, imagine how hard it's going to be to get someone to adopt one baby that has demonic heritage, because some people can't get past the whole tiefling thing, let alone two babies that have that. So they probably split them up because it was easier to find someone who would take one baby than two. No, they probably split them up because one's evil and the other one's all right. You don't know that when they're a baby. <laughs> no one what knows. Well, all right's a bit of a stretch. He did build himself up with a grenade. That's just stupid. That's not evil. There's a difference. Morally all right. Intellectually Ethically. stunted. Yeah, exactly. Admittedly. Either so, way, there's a we'll have, we, so, have, we have a fun chat with him. When Twins working back. with the Nightwebs, potentially. That's, and that's maybe uh, how he got all of his information about Brooks' identities. It's a definite... Oh, true. That, it's a definite theory to have. We don't have any conclusions to it yet. But. It would also mean that... Could be a clone. Brooks could be a clone. You know, are know. working. <laughs> the dragons are Deep working Brooks. with the underworld. We knew that. We, we sure knew, knew that. that. <laughs> um, uh, Lazarin. Diamat being in the hells sort of implies. Yeah, yeah but it, uh, right, 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 right. But right, right now it's like, oh, it's dra dragons and dragons, Not and now, then now I actually, need... oh, well... it's dragons with the devil leader man. <laughs> well, what if we have a Lazarin scry on the evil twin? Do we know enough about that. the evil twin to be able to do that? Well, I believe you could do scrying without knowing exactly who they it's are. It's just less likely it's, to it's be It's the successful. more you know, the better it is. Yeah. Uh, there is one other problem, though. I don't have a uh, receptacle to scry into. Can you just you buy need? a bunch of bowls? Yeah, cool, great, but I need a thousand gold piece mirror. Uh, <laughs> Anyone got, one? Anyone got one of those? Not particularly. <laughs> <laughs> if you fill a bowl with a thousand gold worth of mercury, does that count? A thousand gold worth of mercury? Because <laughs> it would be reflective and therefore it could be a mirror. <laughs> Lazarin, if I could get um, you one. One of the components to scry is a font that, that, that could be, you know, the, the thousand gold thing. Uh, oh, could it be like a. Holy water. It can be a pool, a oh. scrying pool. Or like a yeah, fountain it has to be, a church or it has something. It's filled with like holy water, right? So you, you know, there is a, I've got an hour. You could try. I was like, holy water is the easy part. Yeah, we could go to a church nearby. Oh, Lazarus can just make it. 
<laughs> no, not today. I can't. <laughs> okay, yeah, but we're gonna be here for a couple days anyways because I gotta fix. To be honest, and to be honest, actually, uh, I can't even use the spell well, today. Sounds, that I don't sounds have like the... something the heroes of Exiles might have. Like they're big, fancy, <laughs> famous heroes. They probably have scrying means at their headquarters. That's yeah, they a have thing a bird. They probably hey, do. They have a bird bath filled with holy water at all times, just so you can fucking like. Well, they had they they had that garden they, with the really big big <laughs> trees and stuff. I think there's more for fountain in there. Yeah, it's more well, for herbal more remedies. Too, I believe. Yeah. Oh yeah, true, probably. Um, I mean, we could do. We'll have to wait till tomorrow, anyways, because I don't have it prepared. Yeah. So. But... I'm sorry, I didn't have the new capabilities to use the spell. Oh, well, I, I, I can ask Ron over there. Yes. Yeah. Well, so we're gonna go we're ask going over there to ask for. We're checking for other supplies and stuff. So yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah, uh, we did kind of gloss over that. So you heading one of your things you want to do today is heading to Heroes of Exile to see if you can nix some. Yeah, to scrum yeah. some. Parts and now we and can also stuff. check if they have okay. a means of scrying. All right. Uh, as you get there, oh, it can be crystal uh, you you knock on the door and the door opens and in front of you stands this tall, kind of like towering warrior, eight foot tall, warforged. On his back, you can see this big oh. Swihander. He just kind of looks quite intimidating, and then he looks down at you. You can see kind of like a mouth in his faceplate kind of light up. Hello. Hello. Um, who are you? Mimo. Huh? I'm Jax. Uh, we've become acquainted with uh, Nicole and some of the others here. Ah, uh, yes. I have been told. What can I do for you? Um, well, we were looking for some spare parts to actually help fix our friend here's uh, construct body. I, um, I have a thing that's like you, but not time. as cool. Um, yeah. Instructions were to let you in and, quote, make them feel at home. By all oh, means, that's so nice. Like, makes weight. <clears throat> um, Nemo? Yes? You wouldn't happen to know of a fountain or does a mirror also work, or does it like have to be filled with crystal ball, thousand gold mirror, oh, okay, or so, fountain of holy water? Uh, so either uh, do you happen to know of a crystal ball or a silver mirror or a font filled with holy water that is worth around a thousand gold that people used to scry? We used to, but I believe. Morwen took her crystal ball with her on adventure. Um, could try temple or perhaps convince DNL at the magic shop that you her magic mirror for a prize. Always. Right, especially. Thank you very much, Nemo. Um, no problem. I was instructed, by the way, um, I saw one of you, that whenever you are recovered from your previous bout with, and then you can see kind of like eyes kind of flash different colors, a dragon, go back to normal. <laughs> um, there is a, 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 some people here would like a meeting with you to discuss your plans going forward. But whenever you are ready, just let us know and word oh um okay I'll, I'll let everyone know um how about we say 9 a.m tomorrow okay we'll let everyone know perfect thank you so much Nima. no problem and he kind of turns around and you can hear him kind of like, like this is a this is a big big boy and he he steps like his steps have some fucking weight to him does his sword like almost like drag on the ground because it's so yeah big. like he is super tall but the swy hander is gigantic. yeah it's like massive like, yeah like it, it hovers like maybe this this much above the floor oh like, i love that the floor. fucking throat pierre over here dude. <laughs> dude we gotta bring that guy with us the next dragon shit um okay i will head to the workshop mm -hmm. and look around for any spare parts and stuff i could find that way. make Good investigation check. 
Can I, can you make it with advantage? Cause I'm helping you look like, I'm just like, would this help? Would this help? And I'm just sure. trying to be, and I'm just like, <laughs> sure, I'm just like sure, using sure. the mage hand to pick up any object I think looks helpful. Sure. Actually with disadvantage because uh, it's, <laughs> it's distracting, distracting to Jack. So He's like, Shut no. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I'm glad you gave me that advantage. Cause the first roll isn't that one. <laughs> um. <laughs> that would Loris die. Oh yeah. No, one. he doesn't have one yet. Dude, good fuck. No, it's actually your die, Quibo. <laughs> dude, I actually, dude, all this time, Laura's fucking die has been in the bag. I haven't rolled it. Damn. That's Be careful. Up. It can chip if it gets, like. I have, like, a like, super. Uh, launch, stuff, yeah, no, I have so. my dice tray, and then I also have the super big, like, house pad that is super padded. So I'm, I'm telling you oh, now, yeah. Laura, if it ever rolls in that one, I'm launching it across the room. Just saying that. Well, it'll break. <laughs> it'll chip. That sounds like a, a me have, problem. <laughs> we have the one. We have the one from the wedding that was used for the the bar yeah. drinking game, and it has two chips on it because people rolled it out of the dice tray and like I guess dropped it on the like tile ground. Oh, nice. Love that. Um, that's a total of twenty-two. You find roughly 300 gold worth of supplies there that you can take. So you would have to buy the rest yourself. I will give Diagon back that 300 gold. Sweet. Love that. And then I will... Ooh. There's still that big barrel of gunpowder in here. <laughs> oh, no. There is a, a, a quite a big barrel with that, that isn't completely full, but there's definitely a good amount of... Okay, okay, okay. See this, this, this being you know, long soul. Yeah. Gunpowder there. I was hoping nice. for, cause I have one gunpowder horn, but what could I do with more? You know. <laughs> um, is there any like smaller buckets around? Yeah. I'll I'll fill, I'll fill up a bucket of gunpowder. Okay. Just add that to bucket of gunpowder. Bucket of gunpowder, dude. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to use it for yet, but... Oh. Transporting it. Yeah. Because I can help plan. carry small things with the mage hand, but I can't carry heavy items. In, in theory, it could. Yeah, I'll just like... No, I like, I like kind of like, like put next to things, so like kind of keeps it standing upright, you know? Doesn't move around much. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Um... And then I guess I'll head into town to uh, Athena. Okay. Yeah, uh, as oh, you enter the right. shop, um, it is not as busy anymore. Um, never mind, you slept. Never mind, it's giga busy. Hey, you guys long rested since so came back. <laughs> I correct myself. Uh, it is quite busy. A lot of the employees are busy, but one employee kind of, kind of, somewhat clumsy, looking uh, human. Uh, I would say man, but it's like it's it's like this 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 kid is like maybe just hit eighteen. You know what I mean? And it's kind of kind of stumbles over to you and kind of bumps into another customer and then bumps into kind of trips over his own feet and like bumps into one of the displays and goes, "Ooh, hello, um." What can I? What can I do for you? So, sorry. I have a couple of questions for you. Um, mm -hmm. does Thena allow people to rent out her scry space? Yes, of course, for the price. How much does that cost? Um, depends on how many. Just, just, just the one time. Uh, probably one or two, maybe. Uh, three hundred gold per. But if you do multiple, I might be able to haggle a better price. We'll probably be back tomorrow to do so. I was just, you know, trying to get the information. Mm -hmm. Um, and, and then I have a few things I was potentially looking to sell. Okay. Um, let me just find them real quick. Sorry. You good? Uh, where did I? I need to just like make like a written down list of my. Mm -hmm. Need to be honest, so cluttered right now. Mm -hmm. Stuff jungle remedies? Yeah, I saw mm. some of those too. <laughs> I'm in the jungle a while, man. You never know. <laughs> I saw um, jungle remedies. One of the, do we want to sell the rest of those gems? One of the dragons, guys, no? you know, resides somewhere around those. But wait, the rest of the gem? Huh? We've not done anything. Because, like, well, like, for the four bowls, we don't need all the gems. 
I'll keep all of the gems for now because I don't know what gems we're using. Fair, okay. Um, I just want to make sure that I didn't need to necessarily worry about that. Uh, well, I have this uh, ring of evasion. Okay. Um, can I have a look? Uh, of course. I'll just pull it out of the bag. Okay. Seems in pretty good condition. Um. I think I'll be able to. Um, I'd be able to offer you maybe 800 gold for this. Uh, okay. And how about this potion of invisibility? I have quite a lot of those. Uh, 300 gold, perhaps. A little more from a very rare potion, but that's also fair. That's right, I had something else too. Nope, I guess that's it. Oh, okay. Are you um, accepting those uh, prices? Or? Uh, well, I was. Uh, also, what are you, like your featured items of the day? Just out of curiosity. Well, um, give me a minute. <laughs> yeah, you're good. Uh, I, I, just curious. Yeah. Hold on. Oh. <sighs> oh. Yeah. Have a look, see. Well, um, fully depends on your. How do you say your uh, budget? Okay. I think. What 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 kind of budget are we talking right now? Uh, let's see, a thousand to five thousand ish. Um, let's see. I think for this. <clears throat> okay, thousand to five thousand. Thinking more in the. Rare department of things. Yeah. Okay. Are you thinking armor? Are you thinking weapon rings? Uh, um, if you have it, heavy armor, perhaps some rings, maybe. Okay. 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 Maybe more on the side of plates, potentially. Plates. Plate armor. Uh, yes. Right, right, all right. I do have plate. Um, it is enchanted plate. We're talking full plate here, right? No. Uh, yes. Um. Well. Full plate, mundane, already will run you about fifteen hundred gold. So if we're talking enchanted. I mean, we're talking six, seven thousand gold. Uh, yes, I, I could potentially go for that. I can, I can basically acquire you a set of plate mail, uh, any resistance of your choosing. One resistance of your choosing. Oh. For about, for that price, give or take. Something to think about, I guess. How does weapons go? Uh, what, what kind of weapons would, would you... Uh, well, I'm not so sure I'm looking for weapons. Oh, okay. Um, maybe rings? Rings. Could be something interesting in there, maybe. Sure, for sure. Look. Let's see. Uh, well, obviously, 
same with the plate. I can I can give you a ring with any sort of resistance you you might want. Um, other than that, I have one ring. It's a bit pricey, but it could be pretty useful. Um, it's a it's a ring of regeneration. So basically, um, <coughs> well, uh, every ten minutes or so, you walk around with this ring on. Your your wounds slowly kind of heal themselves over time. Um, if you were to lose a body part, um, this ring can cause the missing part to regrow and return to full functionality after a few days. Um, you know, if you're in the business yeah. of potentially losing limbs, this might be pretty good. <laughs> Definitely an occupational I, I, hazard. I kind of already lost all mine. I didn't want to bring it up. So. You, you know, you, Would it you, regenerate make, you make ghost limbs. deaths look good. I Would suppose. it regenerate robot limbs? Like, could you infuse the magic into, like, a Warforged? Probably. My armor, my armor could fix itself, and we, would have, we wouldn't have to Probably, keep doing Probably, but this. that will be insanely expensive. Like, we're talking tens of thousands. Oh. That is just insanely expensive. I started immediately, like, looking through the thing, and then, like, oh, okay, I don't have that much. Oh. I'm going to kill a couple more dragons for that. Probably. Yeah. Um, but that's a that's... great idea. That's 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 a thing to remember. Yeah, we have some some Could cheaper rings, uh, fine cheap thing. I feel like it's pretty obvious what that does, right? Um, other than that, um, there's one ring that fits your budget that is uh, known as uh, Ring of the Ram. Um, and basically what this ring lets you do is, um, well, it just summons a spectral ram head and just pfft, into whatever you choose to ram it into, really. Is that um, an attunement thing? Yes. Shit. You looking for stuff to not attune? Probably. Let's see. Everything's attunement when it's I powerful. Know. All the super cool stuff's attuned, man. <laughs> Makes sense, but like, um, cringe. Man. Fuck. Ethan, Ethan's home, so yeah, whenever we go to break, we'll enough. get him in. Yeah, here. I figure Evan basically done here. Man, I wish I. Would be, it's easier for me to sort through what is and what isn't attunement, bro. But it just isn't. <laughs> I'm really kind of surprised it isn't. Sucks. I think that would be like an important thing. It's it's all good. Oh yeah, no, anything. it's fucking wondrous and stuff. That's you can check. Yeah. yeah. Um. Right now, this is kind of all I have today. But you know, we get a new shipment every day, so perhaps maybe come back tomorrow. <clears throat> Sounds good. Um, I, I appreciate you taking the time. Um, of course, no problem. How about we do uh? The 800 for the Ring of Evasion. Okay, yes, I can do that. Alright. I'll hand over the, the Ring of Evasion. Gold. Right, well, um, see you tomorrow or not. Uh, either way, you two have a, a lovely day. You as well, sir. I guess we'll I'm back, so I don't think I have anything else I need to get. Unless I need some. Yeah, no. you, you, you're also spending the, what, 200-something gold on... Oh, yeah, 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 the, the 200 yeah, talents yeah, plus. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, we'll, we'll go on break here then, I guess, so that Ethan can hey, get his way up. Yeah. Um, all right, yeah, we'll take our break here, and then Ethan can hop in, and, and he'll be joining us the rest of the sesh. BRB, gamers! Yeet.
All right, all right, all right. Hello. That's why she doesn't do it with Ooh. you. Oh, no, no. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Hey, how's it going? No, talk about hey, my mom. Guys. Hey, guys. Hey, how's it going? No, talk about my mom. Talking about your mom? Yeah. Yes, that's just not. When She's are, a when lovely they? woman. No. No, when yeah, are exactly. they? <laughs> all right, we're back. Ethan is here, guys. Hello. Round of applause. He's here. Everybody leave. Time to go. Is it applause or? I can, I can go now. if you want. Like no, you the most, you've got to put up with me for like two hours. No, we have we have a, a life altering revelation to tell you. You need to stay <laughs> here. All right. Or... So, uh, we'll get back into it. All kind of spent your day going around, uh, you know, going around Kalzir, kind of running some errands, recovering. Okay. Um, Jax was told that whenever party feels up for it that there is a meeting to be had at the heroes of exile regarding their next steps and Jax himself was like yeah we'll do that tomorrow morning and so there's there's that uh and then that when davian attuned to his visage death jaws visage told the party minus brooks about a vision he had when tuning to said item so we'll we'll get back to you all, kind of like back collected at the uh, you know your home base, uh, the Golden Blades kind of old hide hideout slash base of operations. But we'll kick it off from there. Hello, sleepyhead. Unless you were out shopping and we didn't know. Oh, I'm pretty... mm. oh mm. fucking sucked. Yeah, it did. Oh. So. I... What time is it? It right looks now, out at the very like much. Three in the afternoon. Two, like three, three, three p.m. ish. Yeah. Three p.m. Yeah. Hey, yeah, Ken's Brooks definitely just drank a bunch before he like went to bed last night. Cause he's like, oh, fucking go dragon's day. Go, 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 go. Is this is still the second. Yes. No, it's it's nineteenth. I think. <laughs> I think I drooled down it's myself in my sleep. <laughs> you did get um your shit rocked by that dragon, the most I've seen for a while. <laughs> I did all right, but I, uh, I man, I've got so many bruises. <laughs> we looked. We uh, Jax figured out what some of that really? stuff that we took was. <laughs> if you want any of it, most of it probably not very helpful. But some of it. Uh, we, Brooks, we, we, have, we have a question. Okay. Do you have any siblings besides Yorin? Not that I know of. That, you know, like the, that's, that's the thing, though. Not that you can know of. Can I insight of. check him? I can insight check. <laughs> Get him off some lion ass bitch vibes, you know what I'm saying? Lion ass. Bad. 16. As far as you're aware, Brooks seems genuine, and Doran is his only known sibling. Because do you, do you remember back in, like, uh, uh, Ausim, when you mentioned that your alias was being used for as, like, the, the alleged criminal behind some murders, but it was, like, while you were with us in Keldar, so it couldn't have been you? Or, like, you pretending to be your old alias? I mean, I assumed we were going to go deal with it at some point, but then, you know. Yeah, but you're it also... You're all involved in other weird fucking shit. Yeah, but that also could be the answer to this whole prophecy thing. Because what if it's not it's not you? What if you have the classic, like, funny joke, but actually true for you, evil twin? Because then that's the twin in the prophecies. That's the evil version of Brooks who is going to, like, ride for Tiamat. And it would explain how murders are being committed with your alias and, like, the identity you crafted. But you are over here. But then... Okay, but then wouldn't I also be on the the depiction? Like, wouldn't there be two of me on the on the prophecy paintings? Maybe not. Maybe you're a happy accident on our side. Maybe I'm gonna get fucking. No, because that, that already happened to me. I mean, I, mean, I, don't, I don't fucking know. 
Did your dad tell you anything about, like, when you were adopted much? Or did you ever ask? No, I was, like, I was real fucking young, so. But you never asked, like, how did you, like, come across? Like, what, did someone approach him because they knew he wanted, like, children? Or did he, like, find you abandoned somewhere? Like. It's not. Oh, it's not really a conversation, I think you have without reason just a hey where the fuck did i come from you think brooks has got the emotional capacity for that i mean i just had to check you never know well then maybe we might need to give him a call because maybe if he knows like maybe he knows that you had a twin but he's like i can't i can't take two i can't i can only deal with one child right now and so he took you and your twin is out there this feels Being very a bitch. far-fetched Look at our whole lives right now for a minute. Just look at this whole situation right now. And tell me any of this isn't far-fetched. We have, we have, look at this. Hold on, like, pulls out, pulls out <laughs> journal. Look yeah, at this. How do we know you're really we have, broke? We have, we have K Kess's dying dad to still deal with in the plane of air. We have dragons in multiple planes to deal with. We have to figure out moving stars and aliens for Celeste. There's a pirate lady who wants our help. We have to go to a city in the fire plane for Davian. We have to go, like, raid a baddie fortress in New Darabit. This is all absurd. This whole thing is absurd. Okay. No, I don't know. The twin thing seems pretty I'm... reasonable. After... <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm not. I'm not saying to rule it out, but like, is it more believable than someone just doing this? And I'll cast the sky self and I'll turn into a Lazarin. Why is it always me you turn into? <laughs> no, it's not. That's but it's funny. more believable to me than the Brooks that I know turning on us and working for Tiamat. That's what it's more believable than. I know the Brooks I know did also, did also strap a grenade to himself. So you know, who knows what this. Again, stupid, stupid and morality are different things. Different conversation. It's morally Brooks stupid. I know may have strapped a grenade to himself, but he did also <laughs> save your life on multiple occasions. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but that's an excellent rule. <laughs> Either Sorry, way, I'm firmly choosing to believe this is my theory until proven otherwise. And I'm sticking to it. <clears throat> and I think you need to talk to your dad at some point. I mean... It's a good chance it's probably a changing as well. Yeah, it's pretty. But there, the there are a lot of changelings that have been involved with the Nightwebs. Sort of the how they do. And that would also answer the prophecy because maybe just whatever this evil changeling is just likes your your appearance in particular. Mm -hmm. For some maybe, reason. Maybe 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 there's a change. Got a thing for you, Brooks. Maybe mm. less changelings of all of us that are maybe are going around. <laughs> I've always thought to go fuck yourself. So you know, that's a chance. I hate. If you've ever wanted to experience it, now's the I'm time. I'm good, thank you. <laughs> uh, well, we can settle this tomorrow. Um, I, I, I have to admit that, that we can use... <laughs> we can use the Enel's uh, scry space. For no, 300. It, sorry, how much? It, it's only 300 gold. So we use it... Basically, on the fourth use, it becomes we should not use okay, it. Okay, well, we could also trade in our ceremonial like, drum dagger that we got and get... To a crystal ball for you or something. How much does it... Uh, wait, so how much is it to set up a cry space? Well, well it's about a thousand gold space. pieces or so. I just need a this... thousand gold piece, like, mirror or crystal, or crystal ball, ball or fountain full of holy water, you know. And, um, I... The, 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 you, the... I, we... Are we likely to be scrying a lot? I mean, Nemo did say that we could go check I'm, on a it's... temple, and a temple might have, you know, like, fountains with holy water that we could use. What, wait, what was the outcome of uh, Theonel's thing? That's 300 gold. It's 300 use. gold to use her right. scry space. Uh, that seems scry. fair. Oh, she, she said if you booked multiple uses, they might lower the price. You have to Did book you as well. Did you try haggle her down? Well, the guy who uh, no, said you could haggle. No, I information about, okay, like, what, like the ballpark or yeah. spending kind of thing. Uh, okay. I feel like we are... Might just be worth valued customers, you know. We yeah, spend yes, a lot of money we're, there. We're talking yeah. to Theon not herself either, so also, it's kind of like it, it might be know, worth dinging just... so we could, you know, squire on the road. Yeah, but that's true too. Did we you say? Always... Did you say, hey, the future of the material plane and the world we, as we know it, depends on our ability to use your scrying space? Can you give us thirty percent off? You probably hear that a lot from adventurers. 
They you think it worked? Do. Probably not. Did anyone try reaching out to the Heroes of Exile guild and... We, we uh, yes, a a apparently first. Morwen took her a crystal ball with her. Yeah. She what a stinky crystal ball and bitch. Yep. yep. That she did. Terrible. <laughs> Absolute bitch. <laughs> Hate that <Good> woman. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> All right, Mister. Just eats that. chips with fucking chopsticks. <laughs> they're not chopsticks. They're Mini beans, so. and company. <laughs> no, these are these are finger chopsticks. I I ain't afraid to get my hands dirty. I hate that. I'll pull, I'll pull the Cheetos out right now. Whoa! All right, big man. Come Dude, keep your Cheeto in your pants, please. Thank you. <laughs> I am currently disguised as a lab. Stop! <laughs> I have to admit, it's mostly on memory. It's been a, a few weeks since I've seen it, but... Stop being me. But being you so fun. Anyway. Cutting you. Oh, also, uh, the Heroes of Exile, and I would assume potentially the Emperors want to kind of discuss with us uh, our plans going forward. Uh, 9 a.m. tomorrow. Wait, wait, say that again. The Heroes of Exile, and I would assume potentially the Empress or maybe an emissary of hers. No leverage there? No leverage with the scry space? Uh, we weren't buying today, so I didn't feel a need to leverage anything. All I'm saying is, we are kind of a big deal. Did you, you know tell them that the... the big deals did exist you... in this city? We're in the capital city of a... Did you tell like... them that the illustrious Davian Briar is in fact travelling with you? I think they might add on You know, I, I did or... actually mention your name. And they said that they actually charge you double now. <laughs> you're barred. You're banned. Because you have to pay for your ego as well. My ego is not on trial here. Oh, okay, yeah. all I'm saying is <laughs> you could have worked a little harder to get some some fucking to be, a bit of a discount. Around, you have paid it. Oh, the dragon head. Dragon mask on his head. Yeah. I doubt it. We weren't paying for anything, so there was no need to negotiate anything. Well, next time we go, Daddy Davin will do it. You know, since none of you seem to have the fucking... I still also think it's probably worth us just buying a crystal ball instead, but you know. Yeah, it's just... I mean, I, I also was very distracted by the idea of uh, maybe being able to infuse my new body with regeneration magic so it could heal itself and Jax could stop fixing it but they said that would cost like tens of thousands of gold so it's just so we need to kill a couple more dragons and take their hordes and... well luckily on the agenda is one two more dragons it would seem Jax <laughs> it's not a lucky day it's very uh, how difficult can it be we 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 scraped through the first one, who's apparently the weakest, that, so that I mean, me the other three questions. should be a piece of piss. <laughs> or four, we... sorry, I can't count. Do, <laughs> Where wait, do we so your keep piss comes ledger? out to pieces? What? Should we start <laughs> keeping track of, of Dagon's savings towards this endeavor? I, well, I Dagon has her own my money. I have savings, and I'll just keep them until it's I It's two buttons and a piece of string. Shut up. <laughs> no, it's three buttons. It's two buttons, a piece of string, and 300 gold now, okay? How dare you? I will have you know, I actually have 1,178 gold. Oh my Thank god. You very much. Dragon's rich. Should we, rich should we go with buying the, drinks tonight. Should we go with the Benord Dunbar Savings Agency or a Lazarin and a Lazarin? No. <laughs> I have a genuine Dunbar, question. Yeah. Chulas. So after this meeting tomorrow, given who knows what they're going to say, could change things. But so Death Jaw was kind of like made sense because it was close by to Kalzir, weakest of dragons. Everything else, though, looking at my notes, is kind of like far away because the other four dragons, Plane of Air, Plane of Fire, Sigalia, and Agrind. So I can get to the Plane of Fire and... Well, I, I was gonna say that, but we also have all those other things, which I realize might not be as I put with the, like the, the star thing, Vera's thing, Kess's well, this, thing, uh, but, well, and then you wanted to go to the city of brass in the plane of fire. So as the plane no, we already went. We did that. We did that. We oh, did I that. Cross that one off, right? Ha, ha. right. 
Uh, no, plus, as far as like the dragon in the we... ring of fire, you were told would probably be last because they yeah, because that's, that's the biggest that's the biggest problem. Yeah, the dragons. They're, they're also, we um, I feel like Celestie's search is probably gonna be delayed slightly considering yeah, she's it's like probably like the last thing we do. She's she's away for a little bit. Well, she's coming here. Then once she's here, probably start the look. But like, who knows? Well, then I guess it's the question the of the are we going to Agrin, to Sigalia, or the Plane of Air? Uh, well, the Whispering Woods are probably, probably the closest. Yeah, because that's just north, the continent adjacent. Uh, yeah, it's, it's probably about the two day adjacent. airship. Yeah. Yeah. Like, teleport, though, like we did last time. And then thinking across. Yeah, well, airship sounds well. fun, though. And we Long need some way. time to do some. Oh, I guess uh, we still have a break because we need a few more days. Like, we have this meeting tomorrow. We have. To fix my body, so we'll need like forty-eight hours probably anyway. That's what I meant to ask about. Fuck it, I knew it, dude. What? Is that taxi? Fucking a helmet teleportation. I just meant to ask. Oh, well, now um, you know. Well, if they had one, or because well, because it takes me like a month to craft one. So like that's like our whole campaign so far. Um, <laughs> no, it's not. It's not. It, but... it is close. No, it's not. It, it's exactly a lot of down, It's, it's a lot of downtime when we're trying to kill dragons. Well, even if I could just do like a few hours a day, like it's just, yeah, it, 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 it's a lot. For those who are curious, session one was on the 14th of in game June, and it's now the 1st of October. So, July, August, September. Oh, so. It's been three months and two, three and a half months yeah, total. So, in, so three and a half in-game. months, so we'll, we'll round up to four. We're at session 88, <laughs> so in about, so 20, 30 30 in about 22 sessions, you'll be able to. Yeah. Sick. <laughs> By the time you killed another dragon, dragon, at least. Hopefully, we kill at least two dragons by then. <laughs> what do you mean, dragon okay. session boys? Wrap this up in oh okay. yeah, like two months. Oh, well, in that case, two hours. <laughs> yeah, let's go, boys. <laughs> <laughs> let's boot up tail spot. Um, fuck, what were we talking about? Helm of teleportation. No, before that, going to Segalia. Um, that's right, Segalia. I mean, could find I, whatever. We don't know. We, we could see what the heroes of Excel suggest, because they might have more insight into what's more, not more achievable, but you know, at least what might be the better course of action than us. They might have more insight. The easiest. Oh, and that reminds me, Lazar. I'm going to need your arm. Hmm. Oh yes. Uh, sure. And I will... I'll, I'll start miming taking my armor off. I will be taking my armor off and you can tell it to me. Fuck <laughs> you. Please. Uh, please just um, change back. It's so weird. <laughs> they say imitation is the... You know, the finest... Yes, I'm very flattered, Brooks. Change back. <laughs> <laughs> if you're that bothered, dispel it. That seems like a no, waste. Such a dumb. <laughs> I'll drop this guy's self. Asshole. <laughs> Waters. Hey, Brooks. Hey, Brooks. <laughs> Someone can aim you. <laughs> You're going to Yeah. Flynn. So, yeah, I'll give the yucks my armor. So, Brooks has an evil twin? Yeah. Maybe. No, no, it totally does. Totally, totally does. does. Or it's a changeling. Yeah, what, what's more likely? Or, an evil oh. twin, of which we've seen none? Is evil twin who is a changeling? Don't know how the lineage works on that one, boys. A whole lot of cum. No, oh, nice. <laughs> Solid. Is this what I missed out on too? Dude, if you're come solid, I got problems. Here, doctor. No, I mean, I, I, like to this, be fair, the first hours were pretty fucking smooth, and then you join, and everyone just starts. And know, everyone just the beats came out. You bring it out in us, apparently. I'm so sorry, Dutch. <laughs> we found the problem. <laughs> we said it was even this whole time. <laughs> I didn't but, even say anything. Is there anything you guys it. want to do with you with the rest of your day? Um. Well, Jax and I have some work to get down to at some point. Yeah, I'll probably start that tomorrow. To get my infusion stuff done tonight. <laughs> I have a lot of that. 
had to switch around. If Daigon isn't magicians assisting the Jacks, man. That was my plan. He just said he's doing it tomorrow. Oh, okay. Yeah, sorry. My bad. In which case, uh, I will ask Daigon to uh, teach me some more sign language. Sure. Oh, great. What? Is there something in particular? No. Bastard is what wants to learn. Uh, uh, so I gonna, might already well, know that. It's like, do you want to start learning actual, mm. like, you know, think about what you might, like, conversational things, things rather than the random shit we've been doing? Basics of BSL. <laughs> BSL he, teach you the alphabet mm. so you can spell out everything. The alphabet would be good. Yep. Seeing as at the moment everything I know is either like sexual or a curse. Not everything. You also know the words for like Teacup, food, vampire drink, ship. healing, rope, hole, ship, vegetables, dead, corpse, werewolf. werewolf. <laughs> we'll do the alphabet. That makes sense. Because then you can spell out names. Is that feasible in one night, Dutch? Oh, uh, yeah, fucking good. Or the alphabet, I think, yeah. Cool. Go on, then. We're trying to have a conversation where I'm spelling out, like, every fucking word. Hey, man. Imagine. Much, works, it works. Anyone else doing anything in particular does. with their uh, late afternoon slash evening? Yeah, I I'll be infusing my armor and Lazarin's armor with poison resistance. Oh, uh, you do not have to do my armor for poison resistance. Oh, do I not? I am board resistant to poison. In that case, uh, I will ask Davian for his armor to give him poison resistance. I am no longer wearing armor. You're wearing clothes, <laughs> though, right? Fuck it, I don't think Kessler's armor either, so... Can you put it... Can you make it uh, no, because she has mage armor. Kess has mage armor. Can you make it... Bludgeoning, piercing, or... Uh, is it, like, a set action? number of people that are like, hey, this infusion for... Or is it these each individual... Infusions? Um, actually... Ooh, I could probably make it bludgeoning, piercing, or slashing, too, actually. Hold on, let me, let me read the infusion. I also don't wear armor, so... Yeah, sorry, I still have that crown from, uh, like, episode... Or session, like, four. I cannot do bludgeoning, piercing, or slashing. Bro, I love that thing. Yeah, dude. I've been wearing it this whole time, this green dragon scale crown, baby. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's a throwback. Holy. <clears throat> I need the map poisoned. case, man. Well. Does it specify I assume... armor? Yeah, it specifies armor. I assume yeah. you're going to get rid of the lightning resistance that... The, the infusion is literally called resistant armor. Oh. Here, just give me another random one. Fuck it. Acid. I don't know whether we'll need anything else, really. Yo, acid, let's go. We won't need that one for the until the other other dragons. Okay. Sorry, I'm so sorry. Calm down. Chill. <clears throat> I gotta rethink everything. Um. <laughs> My party doesn't wear armor God. anymore. <laughs> no, <Yeah>. I. <laughs> it's like ruined me. Well, cause like, like I, I can't wear... even give him enhanced defense unless, like, I guess I could give the Lazarin enhanced defense. Hell yeah, what's that do? Plus two to your AC. Fuck yeah, give me the what? AC of 22, let's go. <laughs> I might have to start wearing armor, boys. Um, and then I still have another slot open, so I'm not sure what I want to do with this now. What infusions do you have that are cool? Well, we haven't had a level up, so I haven't been able to switch out some of the ones that we don't use anymore. Um, but I have the map case, uh, a repulsion shield, which I was thinking about maybe putting on. Which just gives me a plus one of my reaction, and I can use my reaction to push people away, which I don't almost always use my reaction for their shit. So there's a that good chance that so. when Bell comes back, she will get the dragon head. At which point I will be wearing armor again. But Okay. I will keep that in mind. Yeah. Um then I have resistant armor and enhanced defense. And I have the spell refueling ring, which Elijah has. I can make Gloves of Thievery, which we don't need to use, because I think we actually have a set of, in, of those anyways now. Mm, you don't you have a set? Like, you, still get re you get returning uh, you get returning weapon, right? Uh, I have repeating. I, I I don't have it currently. 
And then the other two are, I have a repeating shot, oh, which I had for when the crossbows diving had. Yeah. It was really good. Oh, you and then Gauntlets of Ogre Power. As well. Yeah, so I can only have so many and I can only switch Ooh. them somehow. I can only like switch like one out per level up or something. So. So if we're, if it functions similarly to like spells. So, yeah, yeah. You, you can infuse Except it's on, X yeah. amount of items, but you can also learn X amount of infuse. Yeah, so I can infuse like four items, but because I have the arm, I'm the armor subclass, I get an extra two as long as they're on my armor. Even though some of them have level so. requisites, I don't know why you wouldn't just have access to all of them. That seems a bit dumb to me, but... Well, it's to make it so that you can't just willingly... Willing fucking thing. Just, yeah. It's to, it's to make it so yeah, that you're, you're not still, just... You're still limited on how many you can infuse, right? So... Yeah, but... That's why you you, all, you basically, like, the amount you can infuse, you have double the amount of infusions. So you have, like, options to switch off of and stuff whenever you want. Just takes, like, a short rest, I think. <clears throat> so it's, like, an hour. Um, I'm also going to tune to the all-purpose tool. Okay. And drop my winged boots. So if someone wants those, let me know. What am I attuned to at the moment? Oh, a billion necklaces and a cloak. A billion necklaces. Hmm? I was laughing at the a billion necklaces image well, of Brooks looking like some sort of like like low budget rapper. Well, we have, wearing, we like, have the like six chains on his neck. We have the night web detector, <laughs> which is on a chain. Hmm. Then I've got the amulet of health. Yeah. Then I've got the amulet of the drunkard as well. Uh, and then I've also got a cloak on now. Is the health ball the one that makes your con 19? Uh, yeah. Making sure. Without it, I lose like. Well, actually, that's not too bad. Um. <clears throat> Without right. Uh, while Jax like was so close figuring out his uh, infusions, yeah, anyone, sorry. Else, anyone else doing anything? I... Nope, just teaching mm -hmm. sign language. Fair oh. enough. Um, well, what we'll do oh. then is, well, Soko. Oh. Um, oh, sorry, I just saw something else. Um, I'm, I'm done with my infusions, but right. we have that. Um. Uh, I, I need to identify an unknown spell scroll from a meditation room. Dungeon crawl itself. Fuck me. Uh, <laughs> let's scroll up. Hold on. Sorry. You're good. Uh, Just... Um, I don't know how I've missed that this whole time. Meditation room. Oh, baby, room. when you talk like that. Yeah, meditation room is what it says. You are me, a woman go man. Fuck you, Duke. There we go. Damn it. <laughs> now it's stuck in Glyph's head. Uh, that is a scroll of gaseous form. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, you found that in the, like, the dungeon hall led into Dragonfell. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Um, and then I also, um, so what do you guys want to do with this box that has the eye in it? Oh shit. Forgot about that. Do we, we have it. We still don't know what it does, right? We just, cause I was scared of it. And I was like, nope. Not I think we it opened it, looked at it and then shut it and then put it away. Where did you find that again? Hold on. I think that was in Death Jaws. I don't know anything about this, so. Room. That makes sense. I found it, and then I don't think it was there. I think hold on, I have to. Is it not? I don't remember where we found. I, I didn't list where I found to it. Flip Sorry. wildly. Hold on. I just have it listed as lead line box with blue eye. Oh, we found it session eighty six. So it was on the dungeon crawl up to death jaw. Okay. There was a walk in closet with tattered clothing, and I found a small metallic coffer in the that closet, and it had the lead line box with the. Eye shaped blue orb is all I wrote. And I gave it to you. So two sessions ago. 
which was, you know, fucking over a month ago in real time. Yeah. So, like, literally, like six or seven weeks ago. I am. Bloodline I box. Am wise. It was in. If there's a room from the dungeon crawl labeled "walk in closet," it was in that room. Oh yes, there was. I did the whole map thing. Yeah, yeah. It was in the. Did I? This is so long ago now. It is. <laughs> did I post the photo when I did the map? So Probably. long ago, I was still not married. <laughs> <laughs> My god, that's like oh, saying it's so last year on like January 2nd. Yeah. <laughs> so long ago that James still had some hope of happiness in his life. Exactly. He still does quite a single. Uh, yeah, that's ongoing. It was uh, just off of the diamond room. Mm -hmm. uh, the diamond room that also connected to the meditation room and the map room. Okay. Right to the very north of the... I'll repost the map. Like, metagamey me has a guess of what it is, but Daigon's afraid of it. There's a few things it could be, and I don't like it. It was even. in the, the pantry, which is right in the top left. It's just a gem. Smile face. And why is it in a lead-lined box to contain magic and make it undetectable? Because all the it's other boxes uranium. were sold out. <laughs> it's, it's just radioactive. And they were gi they were gifting it to someone with X-ray vision, and they didn't want to spoil the surprise. Superman, Hulk? the worst. Gaspacho man. Is he Gaspacho man? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. dude. Okay. I don't remember now. It's go. a bomb. It should have exploded already. Bomb. It explodes. Yeah, I remember. The second no, you no, put no, it no, there. No. Beep, 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 Again. It. <laughs> Are you identifying it? Ooh. I forgot, and now I'm like, oh yeah, sure. duh. Yeah, 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 I'll identify it. Fuck it. It's a scrying eye. That's hey, hey there and we go. It's an item that allows someone to cast a scrying spell once a day without using a spell. Slot. There you go. Fuck it. Do I just run the scry that? Uh, does it say like? Imagine if we'd forgot about that till after he'd paid. And it does not require a tomb. Oh, fuck. Ooh. Dude, okay. Uh, dude, I might. Uh... Do you have to be. Do you have to have access to the spell to use it? No. That's what I was just about to ask. No. Oh, Ooh. sick. Okay. It just comes um, preloaded. Get Elijah an hour of it. We don't need him anymore. Whose DC does it? Does it just use your, like, spell casting? I see we're using, I see we're using my spell casting modifier. Or whatever. Whoever's Probably. using it, it uses their. Yeah. Oh, well, you'll be on using it then. You have to be All able right. to cast okay. spells. You just don't have to be able to cast scry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Um, do we want to try the scry now then? Fuck it. Might as well. Add this to my inventory. So I can... yeah, scrying eye is not a thing in the Inner Beyond. Uh, I'll have to make it. It is. Oh, it is? I see a scrying eye in here. What does it say? Uh, scrying fifth level spell, one charge. Oh, okay. Use this item to cast a scrying spell once per day with a DC of 15. Oh, so it's DC 15. Uh, oh, there we go. Okay. It gives us well, the DC. Yeah, we'll just use that then. Fuck okay. it. It's a lower DC than mine. Yeah, same. Oh, this one's yeah, same free. here. So you can buy a crystal ball. It would have been great if you used my DC. DC. That'd be a 20. Mm -hmm. king. Who are you scrying on? The twin? I would like to try. Uh, let me pull up the scry spell. Well, if he's on a different plane, I, need to, I, need, I think I need to figure doesn't... out how far or like what it makes it easier, right? If it makes it easier is being in depth knowledge, having something of theirs, or like something else as well. Like a... I don't remember. And it doesn't work if they're in another plane of existence. Okay. That's the other big one. Which I feel like we're about to get fucked by. <laughs> so it would be second hand knowledge. Mm hmm. She's gonna have like a plus all, 10 to all this. All you have so is their it... likeness or pick. Yeah. Okay, so it's a DC 13 then. No, that's not how that works. Based on uh, the modifiers. The DC is the same, but he the modifier is just like how much, how much bonus does he get on the save? Because he rolls uh, a save. He gets a plus or a minus on the yeah, save. Yeah, that makes based sense. So he, gets a plus three, so he gets a plus three modifier then. He probably has a bigger plus as well. 
if he's uh, are you, no, it's three are, plus his wisdom saving. So are you? Well, I think we're, we're just about to find out if this evil twin is even. Are real. you attempting yeah. to? Scry I'm attempting to scry on, on potential evil well, twin. Brooks is evil twin. Brooks yes. evil twin. Uh, Whatever. The... Yeah. I can. I, I mean, can I help at all by like giving them information or like? Nope. There's you didn't even know this twin existed. Yeah. No, how I would, meant how about like my this? my alias because you could scry on. The alias isn't a person, though. The alias is a name that a real person was using. So right. I don't know if that counts. I mean, Does scrying right? require your true name? No. Like, if someone no. didn't... Uh, anyways, it's, it's called Broxley, just let, let, let that's just a thing. Uh, it might matter. He might be on a different plane of existence. So, you begin to scry, and you kind of focus on this, this image that Davian kind of described as to what this figure looked like. Um... And you see something. You see. Oz, we're gonna see ourselves. Oh no. There's this, like, you know, you're kind of like this scrying eye kind of appears like kind of kind of in a room. Uh -huh. And you can see there in this room this taller, quite broad tiefling, looking like Brooks, but with more hellish features. Large, wild Curled horns, sharp claws, deep, almost like an amber color, yellow eyes, a yellow orange eye. And he is speaking to a group of three people. The three people he's speaking to all lower their hoods and all visibly a part of tattoo and they're also wearing some 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 ornaments and some jewelry that to you Elazrin, uh that means like they are higher up in the chain um you hear the following you hear this 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 figure that kind of looks like brooks um quite calmly It was only a matter of time before they would have gotten rid of Deathjaw. He was by far the weakest link. Now, they are getting closer. When am I finally allowed to go all in? <laughs> three figures kind of discuss, like you hear some like murmuring under their breath. Too soon to cut loose the chains that bind you here. But soon. And this Brooks lookalike kind of. And he turns around and walks away. That's when you're scry. Ah, was right. Let's go. Just as he leaves, Dude. he goes, If you're that. <laughs> Brooks has an evil twin. Brooks has an evil twin. Brooks has an evil twin. Brooks is gonna be the evil twin. If uh, and this has been this is this this thing. has been cooking ever since I made that thing of like Brooks is wanted in this other place. Like the, yeah, like, this idea has section, been. I looked it up. Session forty one was <laughs> this, when this idea has been in the judge. tank for a while, dude. <laughs> for forty seven. Yeah, who the fuck sessions. let this guy cook? Forty seven sessions. Take him out of the kitchen, boys. <laughs> and then also like then who the fuck is Brooks? I was supposed to do all this shit then. Bruce is about to just fucking leave. He's like, I'm good. You know what? <laughs> you know what, technically, you guys Wait. don't even know I need to happen. Wait, I'm not involved in. I don't have yeah, to be here. You're, Fuck this shit. Your vision, yeah, exactly, right? Your vision returns to you as the scrying spell, like the, the connection breaks. Uh, you're not sure why the, the connection broke, but um, it did. Um, yeah, that's what you saw. Heard. What did you see? I will relay every detail of the encounter. And I'm I'm insufferably like, I knew it! And I'm just getting As like, you, hella like, excited. You mentioned the road figures, and I would say, like, oh, they must... Those ones must have been um, higher rankings in the... If I uh, describe like, what they look like, does a Lazarin recognize? Absolutely not. I, I just worth asking. Other yeah. than he can uh, tell you they were high Lazarin, ranking. Lazarin, yeah. cut ties <laughs> before being introduced to those people. <laughs> yeah. Just, you know, uh, I, no, I, I, I've been, t like, as far as I'm aware, like, I've been told about those people, like, 
hey, if you're this rank, you yeah. got these Valor people. would have told you how to identify the higher yeah, ranks. Yeah. But Rankings, it you know, yeah. They wouldn't have yeah. described. Oh, it would have been like, to. yeah. No. Yeah, so I will relay that information. Like, these are some big dogs. Well, that's. Well, well, now we don't have to worry about Brooke stabbing us in the back. We don't know that, but yes. He might just do it for fun, to be honest, at this point. Not even for any reason. Just because he's bored and drunk. Well, not even drunk. Just bored. But, hey, think, think. This is this is a, a good thing. I know probably overwhelming for you, Brooks. But it's now, even if we keep seeing this prophecy, it looks like to be unchanging no matter what we do. You're not the one who's gonna gonna b betray us or do this bad thing yes but he did bring That's up a good, good point earlier that he wasn't on our side either be honest no. think about all the other people that are gonna indirectly or directly help well it us could mean that he's potentially gonna be to kidnapped do. or killed or sent to a different plane of existence than us i i, I, I don't know we're looking at the positive right now jack i'll, That's I'll what be honest we're trying I, I thought this was happening when we were Busy learning, so. No. I think we would have called. We would have called. We would you interrupt you for that. Yeah. No, yeah. we would be like, "Yo, yeah. we yo, we just got remember, news. <laughs> yeah, We got a scrying orb. Come here, boys. It's TV watching time. You know, like. Put telly on. It's TV time. I'm a on. There, can we check? Um, can I check my circlet and see if there's any, or well, my my metaphysical circlet in my ghostiness to see if any. Can I, can I sense how many done? charges my circle would have just added? <laughs> there we go. Um, Words are hard. You are still fully charged. Okay. That's exciting. It seemed like there's been no attention to buy on you today. Oh, yeah, any guys that want to be pretty Hmm. Yeah, but also not great company. Well, at least we can scry back now. We can scry back. Uh, I mean, areas. we can even try yeah. scrying on the dragons and getting, you know, information on them. And I feel like they might. They must have protection. Surely they can't be that stupid. Or maybe they are that confident, though. Well, it doesn't hurt. I mean, we get to cast mm. it once a day for. What we can do is we can scry on areas, maybe not on the people exactly, but on areas that we're about to go to. It's like if we ever go back to Eldalon, we can see what that's like. We can see what certain places are. We have to be, we have to know the place though and have seen it before. So we can't just do like random plays. But Dutch. Hey. The Whispering Wood changes every time you visit it, right? What you know of the Whispering Woods is that its layout and its. Yeah, like it's an ever changing forest. Um, so trying to scry on a, a way through would not work, probably, because it would probably change by the time we got there, potentially. And... Uh, it's hard to say, plus, you would have to wait a day anyway, because you can only use the thing once a day. So you're out of yeah. for today. Unless you want to go and pay to get some. No, I, I'm just like thinking for future. Whispering Woods is, um, is... you know, what you know of it is that. Um, a place that doesn't even that, that doesn't stick to a certain layout might be hard to scry on. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Well, that was my thought. That's why I was just like, you know, fill it out before I test it out. No, I get you. It's a valid question. Um. Zoo. With this knowledge, knowing that there is. Kind of like a hellish or devilish version of Brooks out there. Seemingly bound to the will and the command of the Nightwebs uh, in, in, in a way. At least for now. That is, you know, you know, add that to the list of what the fuck, <laughs> I guess. Um, the but now you know. List of what but now the you fuck. know. Yeah, it's weird. He's almost more handsome than Brooks, too. Rude. Well, he has that devilish charm, sexiness, you know. Yeah. Very much like a like a feral tiefling version of. of, of... 
Oh, I can't wait for one of you two to get absolutely fucking murdered by him. Can't wait to get rabies when he bites me. No, that's Brooks. I'll wait for you to get killed by him, and then he takes your place. That'd be fun. Yeah, and then we just, yeah, we just, then we just go adventure with that guy instead. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I could kill him and take his place. Right. Hoggies? Sure. Right. But with that, that means we get to kill you? I mean, I guess it might be very cathartic in a way, right? The idea of... You might not be killing Brooks, but you'll be killing Brooks, kind of, sort of. No, no. no. I kill him, I take his place, and I join the winning team. And then we kill oh. him. Yeah, that works. Okay. And then we kill yeah, Brooks. Everybody wins at that point. We throw a party. Yeah. And that's why there wasn't two of them in the prophecy. There and then go. we just flee because to the astral plane. There wasn't two in the, in the prophecy because Brooks kills his evil twin and becomes the and evil then becomes twin. Him. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Oh, we could just cut out the middleman, kill Brooks now, flee to the astral plane, and let the elementals and the dragons duke it out. <laughs> Sounds good to me, dude. Let's run it. I we love go, the idea we, we, have no I we have no idea what's going on in the elemental plane uh, until Davian's powers just stop working. Gone. And then we're like, oh, fuck. This number you tried to Ah, uh, Cosmic probably hit me up. No, yeah, like, really... fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but... Let's get back into uh, the night at hand. Is there, like, you guys yep. all kind of doing your own thing for the night. Mm -hmm. we'll, we'll proceed. Day. Yes, sir. So you all awaken bright and early as you have an appointment at 9 in the morning to get to. Sir. Who the fuck made it 9 a.m.? <laughs> The old man that gets up early, Brooks, brother, motherfucker. Having slept all of the day before is up early, like cooking breakfast. Um, what do you think? He, um, Brooks yeah. goes to cook breakfast is already all out somehow because like they're just so efficient. You missed that when we were going for breakfast; it was like a massive like spread and platter for us. That oh. was that was a, like put there. Yeah, no, I Brooks Brooks goes to cook because he missed that. Yeah, no, that's fair. Definitely. He just like heats everything up. <laughs> it just goes downstairs, it's all prepped, and he's like, oh, fuck me, I guess. Yeah, likely. <laughs> but, you guys heading off to uh, the Heroes of Exile? Hell yeah. no. Yeah. As you knock on the door, the door kind of swings open. Uh, or you, you all see this towering or forged. No. Yeah, it looks down at you all. Good morning. For the meeting, Mons. Yes. Yes, indeed. Good. Follow me. And he leads you all into this this larger room. There's kind of like a round, like uh, more like an oval, like shaped table. And at this table, you see a handful of individuals. Uh, you see the Empress and her emissary. Emo takes a seat, and the two other individuals you see are uh, this silver dragonborn, wearing robes and kind of carrying a, a pile of books around. He has some books kind of like laid out in front of him. You also see uh, a blue-skinned woman with fiery red and orange hair, seemingly in her 40s or maybe maybe early 50s. Oh, uh, yeah. Pretty muscular build wearing leather armor and two pretty ornate looking scimitars kind of like crossed on her back <clears throat> and uh, the empress speaks up good morning glad you all look reasonably okay given what you've been through I didn't mean I didn't want to barge into your recovery time so I kind of just let you Recover at your own behest, but I do hope you're all okay. But judging that you're all very much alive and here, and Asterisk. means you, well, succeeded, and I'm very glad to see you all at least in reasonable health. Yeah. Glad you any complications? Any... Um, oh. a lot of, a lot of, unfortunately, dead air ganasi, which was rather sad. <clears throat> and the, they did infiltrate 
the plane of air, to the best of our knowledge. Because we got there and the portal was already, like, open. Not good. I'm sure if your friends on that plane of existence have not reached out yet, that the managing for now, but obviously a visit to that plane is on the list because another dragon resides there, so hopefully it's not too late. That's the hope. Um, the only main complication, I suppose, was the fact that this was the week of the dragons and... Um... Some of us barely made it out. Yeah, it was a little bit stressful. It was um pretty close. But we did make it out. We did make it out, of course. We did. We did. And I understand and, uh, this the stress you must have He didn't. Through. So I did see and notice the uh trophy you seem to be wearing on your head. It, perhaps a tad morbid, but it does look well, menacing. Right, well, uh, the reason we are having this meeting here is to see what your plans are moving forward and if we could perhaps aid you in, in supplies or information on said journey, depending on who your next target is. Uh, I have with me here today uh, three people um, that, are, that are members of the Heroes of Exile that are experienced when it comes to dragons in their own rights. Uh, firstly, we have... Ark, he is, uh, she points at the, the, the Silver Dragonborn. He's a, a newer recruit, but very knowledgeable and knows a lot about dragons in particular, so that's good. How do you spell his his name? Is it like Ark or Ark? A-R-K. A-R-K, Ark, Ark. okay. Got it. I figured his <laughs> expertise on the topic might prove useful. And I believe you've already met Nemo. Um, Nemo has input and advice um, in navigating certain, well, you know, dragon lairs and, and whatnot, depending on which one you choose. He might be able to provide you with some input there. And then lastly, we have uh, Nicole couldn't make it, but this is Raigel. She is his, well, second hand, really. She has <laughs> some... <laughs> Koi was flashing back to one particular moment <laughs> during the wedding. <laughs> Surprised you can remember any moment. I was gonna say, Koi was like, "Who's that? I don't know this name. Who, 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 just means uh, nothing to me." Right, girl, dude. <laughs> the mo unimportant reference, dude. For anyone wondering, we had like the dice game at our wedding where to to make the bride and groom kiss, you rolled the giant d twenty, and one of the other options you get was the bride and groom quiz you and ask you a question that you should reasonably know the answer to. So we asked a rather intoxicated Koiba, what was the name of Matrim and Kisaren's child? You know, like a whole arc centered around her and like a recurring NPC. And Koiba just ran around one. the fucking front rooms. Couldn't Fuck remember. Fuck shit! Fuck! I mean, this is so bad. No, no, just like, no, right, I was like, so blanked. So I blanked, bad. but it did, it did come to me eventually. It did come Dude. to me. Yeah. That shit fucking sucked. <laughs> That's so funny. And he, he was like, because he was Ooh. intoxicated when we finally, he finally came to, all right, tell me. And we told him and he got so He literally like childlike, just like threw his body down to the ground and like a temper to like <laughs> yeah. sit on the ground like that. Like, no, it was so bad. Because it like just hit, like everything hit me at once of like, <laughs> obviously it's right, girl. Like I know it is. <laughs> like, it was, every mention yeah. of name just like. Uh, Anyways, it's funny. sorry. Anyway. I just, it was so she, funny. Um... <laughs> Is uh, well, she's, she's killed a dragon or two in her day, so when Yo, it comes let's to go. information like, regarding my that, fictional and... child, the only one I'll ever have, all grown up. Oh. And I figure <laughs> these three people, three people might have some some valuable input. Um, firstly, though, um, what were you thinking of pursuing for? Well, the dragon in the Whispering Woods is probably the closest and the Brick, easiest to Brick. access. Bricks, bricks, bricks stuff. Off, yes. Bricks, yeah. He does. Oh, yes. I suppose distance-wise, without having to cross the plains, that would be the closest one. Um, yeah. Plus, we've been to the Whispering Wood before, so we have some semblance of what to expect in terms of the terrain, like to get to him. I think Nemo might be able to provide you with some valuable inputs on traversing the Whispering Woods efficiently as well. Hmm. All right. So, Rixhoff it is then? 
Yeah. I think so. Uh, I'll give the word to three people then. And Ark kind of begins to <clears throat> clear his throat and, and flips open some books. All right. So, hi. Nice to meet you all. Um, I, I I have some studies here that I that I've done over the years on different dragons, and let me just and he kind of begins flipping through books and notes <laughs> that specify green dragons. Right. So, green dragons. Pretty nasty. Um, maybe not the nastiest chromatic dragons, but just overall very manipulative, self-serving. Um, the only reason that they would work in a team is some promise that would benefit them, really. Um, one other thing that they like to do is corrupting lesser beings to do their bidding, so I would not be surprised if wherever he resides within the Whispering Woods, he has subjugated some kind of local population to serve him. So be careful who you trust once you get close to his home, because those people might very much be on his side, whether it be against their will or not. Um, another thing about green dragons that you should know is they're hunters, stalkers. So they, they, they stalk their prey for extended lengths of time, days on end, if not longer, until they could execute, you know, a deadly ambush. So when you are in his domain, which is in this case the Whispering Woods, keep your head in a swivel and just assume you're always being stalked. Because once you enter his domain, he'll know, and he'll be watching, studying you, waiting for a moment to strike. So just make sure to always keep your eyes out. Uh, when you, well, gods forbid, but if you do find that it's necessary to sleep in the woods, make sure that there's always at least someone awake, keeping an eye, for an eye out for things. Because the moment you all put your head down and all fall asleep, you're pretty much dead. They attack with a combination of sharp claws, teeth, poisonous breath. Um, poison is their, 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 their breath weapon. Um, I can stop playing again because I'm waffling. <laughs> um, the lair will always be this kind of this burrow into the ground. So when traversing the woods, you know, look for fresh overturned ground or, well, you know, a giant fuck off hole. It's typically a good indicator of that's where, where you have to be. Um, as far as weaknesses go, um, green dragon skills are a lot less hard and durable in comparison to the other draconic scales, uh, which means they do not share the resistance to sharp and blunt weapons uh, that the other chromatic dragons have. In exchange, though, it does make them a lot more agile and nimble compared to the other dragons. So... Yes, they might be a bit squishier, but they're also a lot more agile and probably just be better at dodging whatever you tr decide to throw at them. Um, yes, uh, is there anything else about green dragons in particular that, that you would like to know? But this is kind of the, the spiel I had prepared, just the general basics, but if there's anything more in-depth you'd like to know, I, I'm all ears, feel free. Uh, what element does the green dragon control? Poison. Well, their, their breath is poison. Um, so they don't really control an element, I'll I guess, sure I in right. that sense. But poison is their, their, uh, their breath. They have these poison glands that kind of grow all the way in the back of their throat, and they, they use it to just spew clouds of, well, very deadly poison. Right? Great. Anything else? Um, that seemed pretty thorough. I'm not sure. When we last went to the Whispering Woods, did we not make make friends with uh, with the Furbolg population? With the Furbolgs and yeah, but we uh, we can't really trust anyone. Yeah, there. that that might have been pre dragon making residence there. Mm -hmm. So now, like, they could be subjugated if what Ark says is. This is yeah, that's what I'm worried about. This it's is quite fun Nemo with those guys. Kind of speaks up and, oh, this is probably where I come in. Um, yes, it is my understanding you've already traveled through the Whispering Woods, so you know the place is unusual. Its layout and environment. Changes based on your destination. The goal you have 
in mind when entering the wood determines what section of the woods open up to you. Part of the woods you are going to be getting into fully depend on what is on your mind when heading in there. So if your goal is to find Brixos Lair, the woods will sense that and only allow certain sections of the forest to open up. It's very strange. So the, the parts of the woods that you'll likely be entering are going to be very different compared to the parts you've been in before. Make sure you always keep your goal in mind, in this case, Brixoth's Lair, because if you falter or lose sight of your goal, you might end up wandering the woods forever, or until something happens. To you. Mm. If you end up making camp in the woods, be very careful, make sure someone is awake at all times. Even, you know, besides a big green dragon, dangerous beings roam the woods at night. Navigating the woods is hard. You don't have to rely on your tracking skills, looking for traces of iconic presence. Eventually, follow them to Brixalt's burrow. But yes, the main things to take away from... Just make sure you all share the same goal. You want to wander the woods efficiently. It sounds good. Um, sense. You wouldn't happen to that. want to come with us, Nemo, would you? I would, but I have this other contract I need to take care of. That's you right. See. It's Fuck quite okay. Yourself, just... <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you wouldn't want that motherfucker on your side? Huh? Yeah, he, yeah. Foot tall. Well, what about... Looking. What about... And you looks at Ryagel. Do you want to come with us, or do you have other insight that these two haven't? Yes. Um, first of all, I have uh, some things for you. Kind of open this 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 bag of holding and pulls out six potions of superior healing and puts them on the table. And well, given that you're dealing with poison in particular, about six potions. Of poison resistance as well. I was instructed by uh, Nicole to hand these to you whenever we had this meeting, so enjoy. Nicole mentioned Pog. Um, He's also mentioned earlier. We've well, seen I him. wasn't listening. We have literally <laughs> seen him. As far I as know. your journey to uh, the Whispering Woods, um, we have access to a teleportation circle in Morvan's room, and we have access to the town known as Port Segal, and from there it's only a two-day travel north along the road, and then once you reach an abandoned watchtower, you can cut straight east into the woods. That will probably be your most effective way of travel. Or as, you know, input on dragon, well, this dragon in particular, um, I feel like everything that needed to be said has already been said. Uh, one thing I will add is that green dragons, due to them being squishier, more agile, sure, but their um, scales are a lot easier to penetrate. Um, go for the go for the ankles, go for the kneecaps. Try to topple it. That would be my advice. Try to make it unable to stand on its own feet. Flip its wings. Try to impede its movement as much as you can. Movement is all this dragon has in exchange for the, you know, easier to destroy skin. Once you get rid of that benefit, it'll be an easy time. <clears throat> all right. So, yeah. I believe that is all we really have for you right now uh, but if there's anything that I can do for you um, whenever you're ready feel like you're ready to add on this venture just let us know in the meantime we still need a day or two just to finish up some other preparations but then we'll we'll be back for that teleportation mm -hmm. for sure okay and uh, in the meantime if you uh, you know are getting tired of sitting on your ass and don't really want to take 
days doing nothing while waiting for the fixing of the armor. Uh, and you want to help keep the streets clean? Um, got some, you know, got some jobs that need doing if you guys want to just do something that doesn't involve killing dragons and make some money. So just know, just saying. Abundance of work. <laughs> You've proven yourselves quite okay, capable. Mind. Yeah, um, I feel like I could do with a day of being a normal person. Understandable. Uh, your eminence. You're in the wrong line of work, then. But the Empress kind of looks up. Yes? Uh, you wouldn't happen to have a potential um, discount with the Enel when acquiring items, would you? Oh, uh... Well, it depends, I suppose. Um, what do you need? Well, I was looking at acquiring perhaps a helm of teleportation or something to help the group get along a little easier. Right. Yes. Well, I have a, I, I have some strings that I can pull, but D and L being D and L, a helm of teleportation, an item that. Easily goes for thousands of gold. I don't know. It might be. She might feel like I'm. How did I say? I'm taking the piss. A little bit. But I can try. Any help would be appreciated, and if you can, it's completely okay. Uh, I'm sure we can negotiate something. Yes, I'll. Um, I'll have a word. With you. Just give me, give me a stay to. to Sounds good. Uh, thanks so much. Of course. She kind of gets up and looks around the room. All right. Well, so for now, meeting adjourned. Then I suppose. Be uh, at home if you need me uh, throughout the day. Uh, glad you all came back. Hold on. Very very happy to see. You. I'm down. What to go? And she kind of yep. smiles at you, but can definitely like in 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 her eyes, it's like she feels sorry. You know what I mean? Like she feels bad. I have to go. You know what I mean? Like I'm she's still grateful like, that you're doing it, but she's also like someone's got to do it. You know? Like yeah, exactly. She, I give her that like just a sort of semi knowing smile of just like, yep. <laughs> After Mr. all the bitching I did about not having an army, I'm like, mm-hmm. <laughs> Mr. DM. Hello. So, we've been in the presence of some pretty incredible people, you know? Like Kasuth and Earthlord and stuff. And they kind of have, like, a presence to them. Would you say that the Empress's presence extends to that of a higher being? Somewhat? No. Not to that. Well, well, describe higher to a lesser extent. Like, well, what do you mean? Well, because like, okay, so right, Jax has been on this little sort of um, fact-finding mission on the side, right? And believes the Empress is a goddess, right? Because she's lived a little long. She's kind of been doing that. Like, it just you know, it kind of adds up. Uh huh. So. I'm just looking for, like, what kind of a sense Jax would feel if that's what he's looking for around her, per Make se. an insight check. Okay. Don't fuck me over. Fifteen? You get... Th th there's more to her. Like, she's not just an elf. Like, you're convinced mm -hmm. that there's more to her. But you don't know what, and and it's it's it's, and it's not like she's goddess level power. Incredibly hard to read in general. Mm. Like the only the only times that she is able to be read is when she purposely allows you to read the emotion behind what she's saying. Or, for instance, when she exchanged that look with Elazarin, that was a purposeful choice to show that like she's shitty that situation. Yeah. So you don't know, man. You don't know. There is there's something about her that's like. But it's you don't you can't put your finger on what it is what it is exactly. Gonna find out one of these days. 
she uh she eventually like her and and Daniel, um, the Empress emissary, uh, leave the room and Ark and Emil kind of leave the room as well. And Rygal stays behind and just kind of looks at you all. Well, now that she's gone, this fucking sucks, huh? This whole situation you're in. You have no fucking clue. Man. It is. I mean, you either die the hero, or you live long enough to see yourself become an even bigger hero. So. Is that what they say? I'm, no. Apparently, but in I'm this not case, even fucking, I'm not even fucking tied into this shit. I can. Oh, well, I, I mean, you are it. now, man. You're here, no? Oh, what do you mean you're not on the shit list of you? What do you mean you're not tied into this shit? If there's someone on the opposite side that's pretending to be you, I think you're pretty intrinsically tied into. Also, it. well, she I'm not gonna say you anything. She looks at you when you say that. She's. Huh? <laughs> also, when Brooks was saying that, I don't say anything, but I just pointedly look at, because again, she is still here, just pointedly look at Cass when he's like, I'm not even, there's nothing keeping me here. And so I'm just like, mm hmm. <laughs> and that's all. So what was that? Run, run that back real quick. <clears throat> oh, uh, you said? Shit, shit's fucked, basically. Oh, yes. He has an evil twin. Like, he for real. He has an evil twin. Yeah, like, for real. Well, he doesn't know the twin, like, they've never met. Because, like, he's adopted, and I think they were separated at like, birth. Like, actual novel mm. stuff. Like, separated at birth. Evil twin. It's literally, like... Or like he's fucking with us, and is super bad. You know what I'm saying? Speaking of, you know, she knows a thing or two about, about being separated at birth from somebody. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fair. You know. Been there. Huh? Um, oh, my God. Well, not I in a queen. capacity. I don't, have, don't have a twin. Uh, I don't have a twin. So. That you know of. I would have said the same yesterday. Yeah, he, like three days ago, he would have said the same thing. He would have said enough. the same thing about 12 hours ago. Honest, never you know. know. I'll have a <laughs> firm talking to my mother later. Um. Yeah, I wish um, that, listen, man, I'm, I'm going to be very real. It's this whole pretentious stuff with the Empress, sure. But, you know, uh, to be very real with you, um, I sucks. It sucks that this is what you're involved in, but, but it's a little bit cool. Given that you did manage to kill one of five, that means you know. I mean, that's pretty cool, you know. Yeah, that I means like her. yeah, but it was the baby one. It's an it ancient, was a full grown an ancient dragon. Is an baby. ancient dragon, my friend. Don't yeah. don't you know? Don't sell yourself short. Like you killed an ancient dragon in my entire life, and all of you lived to tell the tale. Not many, you know. Uh, the amount yes, of people I've also know, killed. The amount of people I know that can say the same. I don't. And it, you know, uh, commander of hell. Yeah, I was gonna say oh. we killed the commander of hell, and I took his yeah. part out, and you know, it's all in a day's work. We will be fine then. What I get from this? Clearly, what I get from this is commander of hell. Worse than dragon. And she could have already escaped death once. Yeah. So, I don't know. Commander Hell almost killed half our party and did kill someone. So. Yeah. Commander of Hell worse than dragon confirmed. <laughs> <laughs> well, we, were, we were a lot we less experienced just... back then. Yeah, we That's... were a lot weaker. <laughs> we were... what, I'm, what, you know, what I'm trying to say is, um, as much as it might feel like the world is against you and it sucks and you hate everything, the fact that you are doing it or attempting it alone is commendable, but the fact that you... Killed one of them. Ancient dragons. Ancient general of Tiamat. And lived all lived to tell the tale. That is a special feat. That sh you should wear that with pride. I agree. It'll be reassuring when fighting the others. I'm sure it won't fucking realistic. matter in a moment, but when this is all said yep. and done, you'll look back at it oh, and, and, and you'll look back, you'll, oh. you'll, you'll have... You know, I can't wait five, for the celebration. Five dragon heads mounted above the fireplace. You'll think back to this conversation and you'll be like, you know what? This riot girl chick, she was right. You know? What about ten yeah. dragon heads? Do we get like a, a punch, like a star card? Kill. Like a, kill I... this many dragons and you get a free coffee. Um, I don't think you can kill a, a god. I think you get like, a lot more than just coffee if you have proof that you killed five dragons. 
get two coffees. They're really good. Get a really yeah, big bonus on that one. A slice of pie. Their card drink. What kind oh, of well, pie? fucking hell. It's all worth it. It's then. a less key lime pie. It's just okay. More, of a... More cheesecake guy, anyway. I'll eat anything. Muffins. To be honest. Anyway, um, yeah, like I said, you know, my house, your house, Nicole's not here right now, so I'm in charge. Big mistake. Um, wine cellar sure downstairs. Uh, you know, make yourselves at home as long as you're here. Fine. Um, you know, I'll instruct everyone to, to to welcome you with open arms. Blah blah blah, all that shit. Uh, yeah, just make yourselves at home. The good alcohol is in a hidden stash. Little wine rack. The second to last, you know, not the bottom shelf, but the shelf above that. Once you take all the bottles off, gives way, and there's a hidden shelf behind it. That's what, that's what a good shelf is. she need it. Noted. All right. Well, pleasure to meet you. I'll be uh, on my way. I got, you know, streets of hells here to... I'm doing paperwork. Paperwork's important. I hate paperwork it. is very, very I, important. You know, when when I got offered this position, been in this business for decades now, and when I got offered a position to be second in command, fuck yes. And then it turns out that all I'm doing. Is I believe second in command also is called admin, bitch. I could be wrong. Yeah, yeah. That's what it seems. Uh, but hey. Been second command a few times. You know, so I where is Nakul? Leave the streets for thirty odd years. It's time for the prodigies to step in or whatever. <laughs> it's boring. What was that? Sorry. Could just like uh, dip so and come with doing? us. It's tempting. What you say, Soko? Sorry. Uh, I was just asking what Nakul was doing. Uh, I believe he is on a trip to yeah to Thurmagar to meet up with family and also uh, you know a lot of the Adilon refugees are coming in there very soon and he's he's just there to help out. So he'll be back in a few days, catching up with some family members, some old friends, some some of the other original heroes of exile also live up there. So he's you know he's okay. a few days to kind of. Relax. He's on, a, he's on a. He's on what we call a bender. <laughs> <laughs> he's. I mean, he's getting he's up there. Fucking, he's getting up there in age. He's on a man. rager. Oh. He goes on. Yeah, a bender for a bender for him is he opens up the door to the party. <laughs> it's the like me and puts the hat on the hat yeah. and walks out and clicks the hat back up. He takes <laughs> two catfuls and I quit. A rager for yeah. him is the an oval team by the fireplace. <laughs> I had a really good one today. <laughs> Don't tell him I said this, but I mean, he is getting up there in age. I doubt. And, you know, two drinks, and I feel like he just, you know, not dead, as in, like, he'll just you know, <laughs> pass out, sleep. It's funny if he's actually dead. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> it's just funny if he's dead, thanks, dude. Um, None of us could kill off their characters and see one, dude. Like I said, make yourselves at home if you need anything. My alive. office is Itch. top floor. You'll see the big door that's marked with my name. Need anything? I'll be there pretty much the rest of the day. You guys, make yourselves at home. Um, use all the amenities we have available. I mean, you know, for for the sake of this, you know, honorary member, whatever, whatever. It's gotta get saunters out. All right. So what I hear is we need to go to the white cell. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I. Uh, I, I think my talents would be better used uh, pairing uh, Dagon's yeah, body. Yeah, and I don't, I can't really, you know, Im enjoy any of the beverages, so I'll go. I'm not to drink help. now. Go on, just see what's there and just take a bottle. Save it for later. Proper celebration. I mean, what do you want to do without a body? Like, what? What's your plan for the day, Dagon? Well, I was gonna help because it's my my body. He's fixing so it seems pretty selfish to be like yes go do that i'm gonna go have fun now bye uh, well i don't mind if you want to do something else i, I don't I know i don't really have anything else i'm gonna say no to a helping hand so 
Plus, who knows? Maybe eventually I can learn to fix it by myself with more muscle. I have to admit, I did not uh, take the time to look around. Our accommodation have a bath. Does anyone know? Oh, they have baths. <laughs> they are <laughs> glorious. I went straight to bed and. Oh, no, they're there. phenomenal. I like one for ages before we before we killed the first dragon. So, you know, they're great. You do, you do know that, Bath. You took one with me. <laughs> so we did. Like you said, many blows to the head. I I said that earlier. You weren't here. <laughs> I mm, look. It it's been a long couple of days. It has been. It's been a long few months. A long fucking life, my boy. <laughs> uh, fuck it. I'm going for a bath, and then I am going to go and find some good eats. I'm going to go to the uh, secret wine cellar, or the, the wine cellar, and find the secret thing. What's the best bottle of red that's there? I'm a Dutch. Um, uh, I mean, I don't have a brand in my head right red. now, but you, I do recognize from the labels and all that. Buying a bottle like that in general is hard because it's, you know, quite a, a rare vintage. Um, you know that if you were to buy a bottle of this for yourself, it would cost you like eight nine. Oh, that's for the instant. Like, it's like, it's like seeing the label and being like, oh, that looks good. Oh, it's one of those ones. <laughs> yes. That's in the bag straight away. <laughs> Go. Close that all up. It's a face Sangiovese. Yeah. It, it's like actually just a cheap Merlot they've put inside an actual bottle to make it seem <laughs> like it. Someone it's else like... like actually, you the label... Someone else already drank it, yeah. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. We didn't, they, they didn't want to get caught stealing that bottle. Yeah, so said, that's gonna get mad! That's mad! <laughs> it's filled back it's up, wax the seal. Water. Yeah, yeah. No, and then I would like to uh, do my bowl stuff. Yeah, make like another... Uh, make another... For the hand check with uh, proficiency hands. bonus. Uh, eighteen. Okay. Um, this this attempt goes a lot better. You manage to pick up a thousand gold worth of, uh, I guess eight hundred. Uh, no, nine fifty. No, nine fifty. Yeah. What was fifty? So make sure to mark those gems. Mark them off. Pick, yeah, pick the value and. I'll just. Sure, I'm pretty sure all the gems <laughs> I've given you off. have had a gold value attached. They had value, yeah. They yeah. Run the numbers with the math and get. It. Yeah, I'll let. You uh, do manage. It takes you a few hours. Yeah, that's fine. I'll, I'll spend the rest yourself. of the day doing like if I can make as many as I can. Um, got... Okay. Well, you make yourself one gem encrusted bowl worth yeah. a thousand gold. Nice. Make another slide of handshake. Uh, 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 23. Yeah, you make another one. Ooh. And by the time you finish with the second one, yeah. it'll be like end of the afternoon. Yeah, so it's a long process. Oh, of course, yeah. I'm going to have to be like really fucking steady yeah, hands. Exactly. Go, go wake that shit to set. Go fucking then go yeah. to the next one. Yeah, no. So yeah, just make sure That's to fine. mark so off 1,900 gold worth of gems. Various inventories. I guess. That's fine. I will, um, as, well. as I said... It'll be, uh, I assume it's just I from whatever the big list that uh, Soko has. So yeah, I'm copying them down into a note and then I'm going to do the math here. So I've got like some onyx or something like worth 15 gold, so like, mm, that'll be worth it. You can make yourself two gem encrusted bowls that you could for, uh, I guess, for, what was it? Hero's Feast? Is that Hero's Feast, song? baby. Yeah. Hero's Feast. Oh. Yep. Super worth it. Hmm. Only if we have time to eat it. You do it the night before, my guy. That's a like 24 hours. It lasts 24 Oh, but then my, then my extra reflux. I, I, I have trouble sleeping. <laughs> oh my god. It took me Sorry, like... I'm it not... took me like... A good, like, I did not understand a word until... Like, the very end. I was like, oh, that's what he said. <laughs> really? In company? Um, yeah. Is there anything Sorry, anyone else wants to be doing? Uh, Jax, you're fixing up uh, the armor, right? Yeah. Make me a, a tinkling check with advantage. Dagon's... Aid. Okay, sorry, I'm just trying to... I'm helping. 
I'm confused. <laughs> um, and this is my Tinker Tools, right? Yeah, I think that means I get an extra D4 too. I'm sure. I don't know. I think your all purpose tool might also be. Yeah, the, the, the D4 is for my race stuff. Let's see, improvising tools, don't come into. I don't think it actually gives me a plus to anything. Oh no, but you have a bonus to spell attack rolls and saving throws. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, it makes those are, really. If you're holding tool. I have like a plus 12 to hit now. Yeah, but it's only, that's only when you use one hand to actively hold. You have to have it. Yeah. Well, for instance, because when he's punching someone with one hand, he has got that tool in his like grip, and he's like, yeah, exactly. I just keep it in my mouth, you know. <laughs> oh yeah, you can like just choose a cantrip. Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, that, 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 that's that. Was, I didn't notice that either until now. So I was like, oh, I'll for the next eight hours, today. I know this cantrip, lol. Yeah. yeah. From any class list. Oh. Uh... Which class? <laughs> <clears throat> Oh, we rolled really 27. Uh, man, you managed to, you find a lot, now that you've kind of fixed this up a couple times, you, you know, your knowledge and your, your, your experience with this, you know, the suit, okay, has grown to a point where, like, it's all just like regular maintenance work. You managed to fix up the entire thing. Oh, shit. Okay. Hell yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. Roll 27. Gotta give you some. I mean, <laughs> take it. Yeah, you, you like, by the time night falls, uh, dragons or forged exoskeleton. Yeah. Fully, ops rate, or for, fully operational. Or super soup. Oh, dude. Where? Oh. Where's my super soup? Vessel? Vessel. I, vessel. Well, I guess it's a vessel. Uh, is Davian doing anything? Her full body prosthesis? No. Yeah. Davian's got nothing going on, man. He's wearing his fucking it's dragon crazy. hat. and <laughs> He's just a man. He's just doesn't try stealing any of the burning bush at the... Um, not found? Davian, as you're just kind of me meandering uh, towards the evening, you do hear a familiar voice pop back of your head. The voice Ooh. of Celeste. Ooh. Hey, hope you're okay. I'll be in Kazir in like two days. No need to worry about us. Everything's going fine. Can reply. Do I know Shit. the difference between sending and message? Oh, uh, I can reply. Probably with Lazarus now. Yeah, you've had sending in your head a lot. You you know what this is gonna feel like, surely. Um. Preparing to fight more dragons. Hopefully, still here when you arrive. See you soon. Hugs and kisses. Miss you lots. Wait, is that 30? Or is that 20? That's 20. I think that's, that's 20. 20. Yeah, five more. 20, yeah. With regards, Stavion. <laughs> Yours. <laughs> Yours truly. Yours truly. <laughs> Yours truly. <laughs> Davian Briar. There you go. Oh, send. Strahd Slayer. <laughs> send. Dragon Slayer. Okay. Uh, you don't get a reply, but, uh, you know. Um, yeah. Cool, 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 cool. Before we go to bed, mm -hmm. I'd like to use the scrying eye. And I want to scry on yeah, mystery. You have to long rest. Mystery higher. This is the same uh, day. What? You've already used it today. No, it's no a new day. No, it's not. We did it on the second. We, we already rested. Oh, you rested. Oh, you did no, it yeah, no, we rest. did. I'm stupid. Yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. My bad. My bad. Yeah. Go on. Sorry. Uh, I want to scry on mystery higher up number one. 
Oh, interesting. Oh, that Bold is not going to go well. So all you know is what they look what like. What they look like. Yeah, so the, basically the same we had with Brooks's win. Mm -hmm. uh, hmm. I know who these people are, man. That's you got a fucking character sheet to find. Yes, <laughs> I do. He's like, oh god. Um, <laughs> so when you say number one, yeah. there were three of them. The leftmost one. The leftmost one. Yep, I'm just gonna go left to right in the next um, three days. Nothing. Fuck. Bastard saved or has protection. I don't think you know why it failed. Yeah. No, I, I, that's just my guess. I don't know. Just know she can't. On them Hell, they could just be on a different plane too. Plane. So. Yep. The next, <laughs> yeah. The next twenty-four hours, they are immune. To yep. yep. There you go. Cool. I tried. I tried. Yeah. Good. Okay. Uh, and with you all kind of getting into into you know getting getting into <laughs> bed for another long rest, with a couple of days to kind of you know do what, what, whatever you want, whether that is. Hey man. Pick up a small bounty to kind of keep yourselves busy or relax for a few more days. I think this is a pretty good spot to say, you know, for oh. next week. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We got the ball Dude, the rolling heat, again. The heat has got me fucking brewmaster boofed, bro, so. <laughs> I was just saying, that's why I've, you've seen, I kept having to pull out the, the fan because it's yeah. getting toasty in my room right now. <laughs> yeah, we'll, uh, we'll call it here. <clears throat> a little, little earlier than the normal, but whatever. Um, fucking phone. You know, Recovering from the first dragon fights, you know, you've got the information and your plan is set out for next yeah, fight big ahead. Big plot reveal, evil twin. Big reveal. Big reveal, Rygo, still alive. I didn't kill her off in my brain. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, she's like in her like late 40s already. Yeah. Don't, don't make yeah. Rygo cool. Fucking I don't want to have to make another mini. What, 30 years post? News campaign. She was yeah. like a teenager. She's no like, longer an angsty teenager. teenager. When, when yeah, she, she was a teenager. Yeah. So she'd be like, she's now late forties. An angsty this, mid forties. It, it's no, it's more like isn't it a little longer than that? Wouldn't she be like tough in? Uh... Come, on. Come on, no, no it's come on, no. yes, Legend of Korra. Um, yeah, slightly less old though, I think. Mm -hmm. I think Rygo. No, sure? because it's only been like it's only been like twenty five, thirty years. It, and she was sixteen in campaign. We are, we are in the thirtieth year of the fourth era. The fourth era began when, after the Hero of, of yeah, Exile. Say, I guess she's like so, yeah. okay. forty six. She was okay. She's, she's like, forty six. So she's, forty, yeah. she's forty six then. Well, there was a small time jump in campaign as well. So let's say that she's like nearing fifty. Yeah. Yo, oh, Laura, how mad would you be if I banged your DMT? <laughs> well, that's not weird because I'm not playing her mom actively anymore. That's good. So. Laura, Laura wouldn't be upset. Celeste. Well, to be fair though, we don't even know if Ragel's married. So. And also, again, you'd be doing it, oh. uh, uh, hopefully, with consent, and that was the key difference from the yeah. other time it was brought up. So. <laughs> True. I feel huh? like it's different. It's fine. That was huh? back like way early. There was this Dude, talk about way like, using far a ago. It was like and one joke. It was, and it was like. It so was like oh. session yeah. ten. Or oh whatever. yeah, it was, it was God, early. I remember that. Yep, 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 yep. Giga early. Yeah, yeah love potions. It wasn't so you love potions. I, I just want to see you try it. I want to see, uh, just see how it goes because that'd be interesting. So she's probably married. <laughs> she might be for all we know. Also, for for Ganassi, I think they their lifespan's a bit longer. Like it's like average one hundred and twenty years. So that's still like the first like third of her life, even though she's approaching or like just over the first third uh, of her life. Up to one hundred twenty years. Don't remember. Yeah, because uh, according to fifth edition D and D, yeah, up to up to one hundred twenty, yeah. Um, and so she's so like, like more like in her early thirties ish. Yeah, so it's like the human equivalent of being in your thirties, yeah. But yeah, uh, it's good so to she be back. Would, like gamers. age age wise, that's what she would display. Yeah, I'm just gonna yeah. get the play today, dude. I'm very happy to get the ball rolling again. Obviously, you know, we took a longer break because of you know the majority of us being in Canada and all that stuff. Yeah, we we really but, um, went to a wedding, huh? We did that we were really in Canada and I hate that. Laura's really... a married woman. Laura's now a married woman. That's crazy. Off the market. We, we really went to Canada. <laughs> Dude. Is that a maple leaf shot glass? Uh, we yep. really went to Canada. Amazing. <laughs> and uh can't wait to go back, man. Canada is now like Dude. <laughs> I wanna go I back. need to hit up Anne on Facebook. Oh, like dead ass. Who my mom? My mom doesn't have Facebook. Yes. My mom has no social media of any kind. 
Well, then can I we need your do, mom's can number. We, can we just like, like, oh, message your mom. Dude, how do you think my parents are the only ones in my family? Like, my, my family are the only ones who don't know that I'm bi because they own, they use no internet social media of any kind. So I'm open about it on the internet because they have no way of seeing it. So. <laughs> can, we, uh, can we just schedule like a phone call with your mom? Like, a, or get her to come she to like. Uses, she uses Zoom for work. You could have a Zoom oh, call. No, get, get her in a Zoom <laughs> Next time. Next time she comes, Zoom call with Ann and Joe. Just bring us on Discord. Oh god. Yeah. But um, yeah. Thanks for watching, yeah, gamers. We'll be well. back next week, hopefully <laughs> with a, a full house. Are you a, a break week. joiner next week? Or are you just good for the start? Next I week? am a break joiner next week. Okay. Uh, apparently, things are prone to change because okay. I. Oh, you you weren't here for that. You were on break. Um. He's going my, on a work trip. Oh. Yeah, I'm literally, it, I got told, oh, by the way, you're going on a work trip this Thursday. Oh, okay. I mean, uh, yeah, so fine. my shift schedule might get moved around. But yes, as far as I know, so far, I'm a break joiner. Okay. Nice. All right. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being here, gamers. It's good to get the ball rolling again. Um, yeah. For now, I think we're good schedule wise. Like, summer might be a bit bumpy, but I feel like summer is never really that crazy for us because mm. it'll just be like, mm. oh, some people missing random sessions. There's, summer has never um, really been like a, oh, God. So, not next it's mainly, session. It's mainly session the holidays after. that get crazy for us, but summer, mm -hmm. I feel like, is always pretty chill. The session after next, Again. which is the second, I'm a, I'm a not here boy. How dare you miss that session? It's fine. But then after that, I've specifically requested to be on opens on Sundays. Yeah. <laughs> so that you can be uh, here. So I can be home in time. And management yeah. were really cool about it for the most part. Like, it's not a guarantee, sadly, because Sunday's our busy day. But, Sunday's yeah. the yeah. busiest day. So, but yeah. also, like, they're paying me enough money where I had to be like, sorry, boys. Oh, yeah, no. It's fucking get that D &D. How dare you? Man, they nearly doubled my my annual income. That's I'm crazy. Like, go back, um, go back to your old job. <laughs> we like go to back to the coffee miserable. shop. No, um, yeah, like I said, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll be here again next week. Uh, see y'all later. Uh, I'm, I might be doing some streams this week. I want to get back into streaming, and I've been playing a lot of video games again. I'm no longer Dude. a depressed piece of shit, so I might actually have to drive. I love that Dutch goes We should bring back the boys' stream. Like, it felt like a game sign. I don't remember. know. What? Dutch goes through these cycles of, like, I'm not streaming, I do YouTube, and then, like, back into yeah, I'm streaming. But now, now I'm, like, no longer a depressed piece of shit because I actually like my job and I'm in a good position right now. Yo, I know that feeling. Um, what's that like? What's that like? Ah, uh, you wouldn't get it. You wouldn't know him. Yo. You went to a different school, you know what I mean? Um, <laughs> thanks for watching. You wouldn't everybody. know her. <laughs> Bye guys. Bye. 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 Love you.